Yo, what up, everybody? Welcome back to the San Pluto Show. Um, we back again. So happy to be here. Uh, you might have to zoom me out a little bit, Gallon, but uh, uh, <laughs> my shit. Um, but we we back for another show, guys. I'm super excited to be here. You know, I feel like I've been gone for such a long time. I, it, it feels that way. So we back. Um, we got some really cool things brewing um, for for the community as far as different things and fun things that we're going to be re releasing. We really want to make it engaging and um, just really different in, in comparison to uh, other shows that are similar um, or do similar things as far as reviewing music. Um, but um, I'm going to have God uh, punch me out real quick, y'all. So y'all bear with me real quick. I want to, you know what I'm saying? Hold on. What y'all think about this right there? Yeah, and let, let us know how we how we sound, how we look, and all that stuff right like that. I, I see a ton of people um, made it to the website. A ton of people on the website right now. So if you have any questions about sending music, make sure to come to the YouTube right, and I'm putting the links in the chat right now. So you may be watching the show on Twitch or Facebook, but um, if you don't mind hopping on the Sam Pluto Show's YouTube, um, that's what we live at, and that's where everybody's going to be uh, chopping it up at as well. So uh, get your music in, um, all that good stuff like that. Okay, God only got me on. I know. I, it's, I don't know what it is. I was trying to hide that speaker. <laughs> Why? Because it's crooked. Get me, just get me in the shot. It looked like it's it looked like it an earthquake in L.A. Just get me in the shot. Look, look at me. <laughs> Goodness, what do you want me to be, over here? Okay. Here, just come, come on. Just, just, just give me in a shot, bro. <laughs> okay, so I'm, I'm gonna sit over here like this. But look, <laughs> we got a really cool show today. <laughs> we got a really cool show today. Um, so, like I said, if you have any questions, send in your music. Do so. Um, we do want to bring back the track battle. So, if you want to get in on that, uh, our plan is to get everybody back in one, which is in the YouTube chat right now, and then the next one. Um, uh, so not the one coming up, but the next one after that, we're gonna do a cash prize, right? Um, so again, everybody gets their music in, you get the vote in the YouTube chat and you see your vote on the screen and we don't have me and Gallen or the guests have no vote in it. Um, it's only the audience vote. So that's how we deem, uh, the, the winner of the contest. So if you want to enter that, it's in the chat right now. Um, and again, if you don't want to wait, uh, today, um, the options to uh, skip the line is in the chat right now on YouTube as well. But, you know, I want to get started with the show because we got a, a special guest in here that I want to introduce. Um, he goes by the name. He goes by the name Flo. Bring him in, guys. Yes, sir, Steve. He's side in the building. Fire. East side in the building. Hey man, Gallen got flu looking sure. good, hey, man. man. God, you know, I ain't mad at it. You know what I'm saying? Man, I, I like that. Yeah. Humble for the rumble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so we got flu in the building, man. I put his um, Instagram handle uh, in the chat. Yes, sir. Um, oh, whoa, 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 we got Perry here. Wait a minute. Uh, we got some uh -oh, people Perry, here. Damn. Uh, so we got all, all our people coming through. So we got flu. Make sure to follow him. Uh, super dope artist, lyricist. Um, it makes really dope music. We may get to some today as well. Um, and again, thank you for being on the show. Oh, Something no, different, shit. not thank the normal podcast. Me. It's not a podcast, it's a show. Um, and thank you for doing this, oh, man. I'm super excited. Sure. All right. Thank you for having me. I'm Absolutely. good. I'm ready to hear some music. I got my listeners yeah. on. You know what I'm saying? I'm ready to hear something. Yes, that's what it is. Listen, so I told um, Flu what we're doing today. Um, he knows about the X. Uh, the red button right there. Don't so don't make me use this. Don't make him use. It. He don't says, make me use "Hey, this. he's gonna be real." Man, we've been living large, baby. <laughs> he, 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 he he's gonna use the button if he needs to be. Definitely what be. we what we the house rule is: if we in a free block, then of course we can use uh, the button. You know what I mean? That's that's what we've officially decided to do. Um, but again, uh, we got some producers in here, so uh, definitely uh, link up with uh, Flu. His Instagram handle is in the chat. Um, if you want to uh, link up with him as well and send us some dope production, even though he's already got cooking up an album right now, that's what what percentage level of completion we at right now with the album? One hundred percent. One hundred percent. So well, well, gotta wait to the next one. But uh, <laughs> all sent, all clear. But I'm you already know how that goes. So like it's complete and it's done. Yeah. So but it don't drop till May seventeenth. So I have time. Of course. If I really got something that was really fire. Uh, it can make it, and to be honest, I mean, mm -hmm. just going off of that, uh, shout out my player partner, uh, 3D, 3D make beats. Uh, he right. just sent me a pack, and there was one in particular on there that 
could definitely make the album. So, oh, wow. I mean, cutting board. You know, that's just where it is with it. Shout out to my sister in the chat right now. Shout out to everybody in the chat right now. Uh, if you're tuning in for the first time, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And if you haven't shared this uh, live as well, make sure to do that. But before we do any of that, how you doing, Gallon? Gallon. Mixed first for Gollum with a oh, dope well, shirt, well, man. Well, man, this shirt was not cheap. That's all I'm going <laughs> to say. It, it's dope because the it shirt works. was not cheap. Yeah, yeah. Shout it out works. to the non-cheap shirts. Uh, yeah, it, it fits well, man. Everything it is works. good. Fly. You know, so. Uh, okay. I like Excellent. that hat that uh, flu got on. I know that. You know, that hat is fucking paper fire planes, shit, man. man. I love paper planes. Yeah. Great brand. Great service. Just like this. Listen, let me tell you. I've been on a few podcasts. Okay, okay. Recently on the run. You got some shit going. Hey, man. I love the setup. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. The hospitality. It's been yeah. a great show since we've been here. It was Man, easy to link it. up. And so, I mean, people don't know. We go back. Way, yeah, yeah, yeah. Way, way back. Way back. So, Holy. Yeah, like, I'm talking about, like, Ams might be going back to 97. Like, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's been like, some time. Yeah, so. it's been some, like baby is a pacifier and shit. <laughs> Man, I love seeing people. Like get their shit off and like yeah, yeah, yeah. seeing where you at with this. Like I love it. So man, man definitely shout out here. to you, man. It's dope. Big shouts out to you as well, man. It's been a minute. Uh my sister in the building. Oh, look, somebody's already started the madness. Uh I know, I know. But but again, I just gotta say once hey, if you fuck with Gollin shirt, put your favorite emoji in the chat right now. <laughs> like, cause the shirt is clean, dude. Man, you know what I, I really like you like and but the it's like after you wash it, it still feels and looks good. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah, that's a quality that's that ass quality. shirt. You know what I'm saying? That's that tribe. So, like, music? Oh, is that on there? The San Pluto show? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The the San S A N P L U T O show dot com. So if you're on my live right now, shout yeah. out my my player partner, uh, Black Mexico, or anybody I okay. got music y'all want to submit. That's a good run of people in here. The, the chat is going crazy. So send your music. Let's yeah. review it. Let's get it popping. But yeah, definitely submit, man. This is a dope platform. Thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah, it's, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm loving it. Yo, yeah. we got some stuff coming up. We got a special guest coming in next week, Amzai. Man. And My we man got coming in from Atlanta. Atlanta, oh. flying in, do a CD release. Damn. Yeah, we doing like uh, he said he he chose our show to release his project yeah, on. Man, so I mean, fine, shout out man. to our guy Greg Rufus. I'm super pumped up about that. That's dope. I don't even know what we doing, but I'm pumped so, up about. I hope Pablo <laughs> so, pa Pablo already hating. Gallon shirt is whack. <laughs> Kidding. All right. <laughs> oh, oh, oh shit! It's starting. It's starting. All right, Nani. So, I'm gonna make an executive decision. Okay, what are we doing? Because without the people that are free. Okay. Nothing else matters. And so okay. I think we should do a 30 minute free line. Woo! Um, one minute. One minute. On the clock. And then limit it, unless it's it plays all the way through. But like Listen, one minute plays it, all the way through. And then short, short, we we don't we're not gonna say a whole lot about it. Unless it's uh, just five. Okay, I got you. I wanna I wanna be funny at the same time with this. I'm gonna make an executive <laughs> statement. Okay. <laughs> if if y'all don't want to wait, blame Gollin. <laughs> blame the shirt. Blame the shirt. Blame the shirt. Shit. Man, yeah. we got some people in here. Shit. So look, let's get straight to it again. We got Flu. His information is in the chat. If you if you're a producer, yes, you're an artist, and want to link up with him um, uh, via DM, uh, that's his Instagram handle. Make sure to shoot him a follow as well, because yes, he's always cooking, man. Um, At Flu as season well. Eighty three. Send me some. Like, I'm always willing to work. Yes. Yeah, so let's make it. Let's make get sense. it. So we're gonna, start, we gonna start let's today or we're we gonna start uh, when we got the first I'm gonna make in. an executive decision. There was this person named Carly the Pilot. Okay. I, I mean, the so name looks I'll drop. Yeah, I'll drop the other ones. Yeah. I, I only put her back. Oh, I don't know if you know. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this person on back because the name was Fire. So no, that's fine. That's fine. I don't know if the song's gonna be Fire, but we're gonna do a 30 minute uh, free block per Guilin. All right. Yeah. So just listen. I know everybody sent in. We got a 20 that got sent in, a 10 that can send in. Um, but sometimes, and this tonight could be one of them nights that we don't even get to the free music until eleven forty-five at night. Right. Um, and if we can't, we can't. We gotta, we gotta make sure that we fuck with the people that got us here. Absolutely, right? I, I do agree. What up, Jay? What up, everybody? What up, moderators? What up, everybody in the chat? Please, up, Jay. Let me know house. how y'all feeling. One through ten. Pop Perry. In. Perry with the super Perry. chat already is going crazy. <laughs> look, look, let us know how y'all feeling one through ten. But we about to get through uh, this first song. Uh, I think it's Carly the Pilot. The name of the record is called No Limits. Uh, they, what they said was this song was written prior to having a beat. Um, I guess that's the beat was constructed around the lyrics. Uh, poor beatbox example sent 
to the producer don't give up on what you love i'm an artist from houston hey that's what they ended with hey i don't know if they <laughs> hey that's right. they so we don't bit. i don't know where we're going with this but they put it on spotify so for to me again they deemed it worthy to put up in there so, but this is the free block so we're gonna do one minute play of this record right here say a little bit about it and then we'll get to the normal uh schedule programming again we got flu in here we got guyland making us look good sound good at the vibe pod Perfect. media Okay, Jade at a nine. Shout out to the recent graduate Jade. Make some noise for Jade in the Congratulations. comments, man. Congratulations. Hell yeah. So this record right here, again, That's Carly nice the Pod. Cover art. Nice cover art right there. All right, so let's get it. I'm going to hit the play button and we're going to go from there. Here we go. Oh, look at me. Look at me. You know, let me cut it up. Maybe that that'll be better. Here we go. Mm. Money. I'm all about my money and money. You know I got obstacles, but I ain't by dropping you. I'm thinking about some lotties, thinking million more than I be. And I'm in a little shot. I'm all about my money. started off man like um again we in a free block right now uh, i'm not gonna lie i didn't like the record uh you know it, 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 it. mr fresh okay mr fresh shout out to mr fresh yeah, long time no see, dog. Mr. mr fresh cook this shot of here um listen uh 30 they, minute free block by the way 30 minute free block they prefaced the whole record saying they wrote the song before and the beat was constructed around it so they, they, obviously everybody did the best that they can do i don't know if the producer was able to successfully obtain the bpm of her vocals and match all that together we don't know um but it sounds really more like a demo meaning maybe an idea that they were still working on you know but it made it to spotify you know they you know because again me when i see music on spotify I automatically deem like yo it's ready they think this is the best record ever it's mixed to perfection i think all of that when i'm listening to any artist on any dsp i don't care who you are i just think if your music is on a dsp that's letting me know that you said i'm better to make a good impression on everybody the, mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying like this is my first time they're gonna listen to our music so i'm like are they ready so that i don't think they was ready it sound like more of a demo uh so i'm gonna just keep we keeping it short initially y'all so i'm giving that one through five mix mm, no uh I'm, I'm definitely like at a solid i'm at like a solid 1.9 out of five i mean we starting rough but uh you know I, I definitely wanted to get that person to play because the name was cool cool name you know what i'm saying Definitely. Uh, I mean, I feel a little bit the same. I feel like um, the beat was stronger than the song. So it was really like loud and you right. know, it was really like the beat kind of overpowered the song. I don't think there was enough going on in the song because it was just like, like two bars are like, get at me. And then it's just quiet. And it's a strong beat. And then it's just, get at, it, it wasn't, the, the song didn't give me enough. And so the beat overtook it. So because of that, um, you know, I, th I think it's, you know, it's a good, a good start, good effort for you. But I mean, I said the beat was way too strong. So right. it was just kind of, I would, I would go in the start. same area okay. about, about a 1.5 to mm -hmm. two. Okay. Gallon. Yeah. I'm trying to figure out how to block fools on, um, what's going on? You know, dropping the N bomb in the chat on YouTube, not the YouTube. No, on Twitch. Yo, Twitch is fucking <laughs> insane, but kick is even crazy. I don't know if y'all heard a kick. Yeah. Bro, kick, bro. Don't even, yeah, kick. Rum, don't, don't even think about streaming on Rumble, y'all. Mm. Fuck oh, that. Do, do, yeah, like, yeah. like that's for like psychopaths. <laughs> kick is like, okay, I might be a psychopath, I might not. And then Twitch is just like another planet. It's yeah. just another yeah. planet, bro. Yeah, it's like Twitter X. It's Twitter X. Twitter X. Right, man. Ooh, Yo. I wonder if they they might be cooking up something like to take over like OnlyFans, Twitter X. Ooh, yeah. wait, Twitch X. Twitch X. Wait, wait, so no, wait, Twitter you, X. 
It's Twitter. Yeah, Twitter X or that X or whatever you want to call it. My bad, but who's who, what? They what they dropping the crazy language at on on Twitch or Twitter? Uh, on Twitch. Twitch. Okay, Twitch. so I'm saying, my bad. I meant to say Twitch. Yeah, X. I just had to block two fools. Ooh, that'd be yeah. crazy. Anyway, go ahead, Gallon. What are your thoughts about the um, Ricky user? Oh, and Twitter, Twitter X or Twi- Twitter already got OnlyFans yeah, stuff all over. I know that's the biggest much. porn. But Twitch don't though. True, 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 true. Um, yeah. <laughs> I like the beat on that one. Like I kind of felt where it was going. It had potential. Um, and, and you know, sometimes my stuff, my 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 reviews start off a little bit higher. Um, and then once I hear you know your critique, I'm like, oh well, you know, he's right. So <laughs> I'm at a I'm at like a two point one. I didn't hate it by any stretch of the imagination. I thought the beat was fire. Um, but you know, it is what it is. What'd you say it was fluke? What'd you give it? I gave it like a one point five. I didn't hate it. Yes, I the, the beat was just so strong. The yeah. beat was came on so like strong, and then the voice was a little low, so it, it just seemed like the beat was you definitely can tell that the beat was made around. Yeah, the, the, the it was jacked. Sure. Yeah. All right, cool. Well, um, you know, question of the night: What is your favorite platform? Drop it. Your favorite platform to do any kind of socials on. Drop your favorite platform. Um, MySpace is Am's eyes. Listen, after we do the free block, I'm I'm a, I'm a pilot a new segment that I want to do. Am's eyes picks. You know what I mean? And it's gonna be like albums that I listened to recently. It's a couple of albums I listened to that I absolutely love this past week. Um, and I want to start doing it weekly, you know, um, and showing the cover arts of those particular picks. So I'll, I'll kind of show you a little bit later. Um, and I want to talk about what y'all been listening to as well during that segment. So next oh, up. Okay. We got um, uh, where we going, Gala? We we skip into uh, uh, let's hit up um, Charlie the pilot, yep. no limits. That's what we just heard, right? Yeah, we just we just. Oh, that was Charlie the pilot, mm-hmm. no limits. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, that shit, that's right. Um, let's I, go to uh, yeah. Zins, plugged, plugged, Zins plugged. That was at uh, I see a lot of Zins here. Zins plugged was at uh, four thirteen. 413. I'm sorry, 437. I got you. Zins. Is, is is that is that Xander? I think it is Xander. Because they, they might have sent some new music uh in. Let me see. Let me see if they did. Let me Hey Xander. Them. Um he's there. They're in the it's uh, you send it looks like you're sending three songs. We're doing a one minute free block. You got paranoid plugged and all mine. I'm sorry, um Zell featuring Avi Bands, Paranoid and then Plugged. Which one do you want us to play? Yeah, let us know in the chat right now. Pick the best one. Okay. So Perry, you are correct. YouTube and TikTok got the best opportunity to grow for real. Yeah, it's crazy. It's absolutely they're crazy. Trying to, they're trying to shut down TikTok. But I know. That ain't going to happen. Yeah. If they do, people in trouble, boy. Like, oh, God. Well, what happened was, <laughs> it, and it's because it's political season, Amzai, they floated. They just floated to yeah. see what everybody's saying. And when they got the pushback, said, shit, they're yeah. like, oh, hell no. Mm-hmm. Uh, plugged at uh, four, uh, 437. All right, so we're going to SoundCloud for uh, Zins, if I'm saying that correctly. He's, uh, they said it was it's, it's a different vibe uh, this week, different energy. So we'll see. This record's called Plugged. Here we go. Okay, hold up, hold up. Go ahead, go ahead. Real quick, everybody. We are doing a 30-minute free block. Free people is what got us where we are. So at 930, we will start playing um, all the other songs. So, um, yeah, we got everybody's cash app. Uh, the free line right now is looking like Rick on. Uh, Mr. Fresh, Slow, Soul, po- Pow. That's the pay line. You, uh, yeah. Pay line, pay line. And then Perry Lawrence. So we got about uh, 20 minutes left on the free line. And it's just people have already sent in music. We're going to try to get to as many of these as possible. One minute plays unless we really like it. All right, cool. Here we go. So this is ends with Plug uh, featuring Lil Biscuit. You know? Lil Biscuit. <laughs> Lil Biscuit. Here we go. Biscuit. All right. Biscuit boy, cook. Shout out Perry. I'm smoking on that gas, yeah, that pressure. No, I ain't a cop, but that girl bad, might arrest her. She's matchy to my feet, I keep them hoes in a dresser. That boy play with me, got this clock, it could press it. Don't know who you testing. Yeah, this shit is trash, it ain't no checker. Diamonds on my bezel, black and white like some pepper. I should get a medal, all these bitches lick me up. Yeah, I always keep that metal Glock on my side, if they tuck. Yeah, it's always staying 
talk Even when I'm in the club All these bitches lick me up I taste a coupon, I'm ballin' like the bugs And that ride speeding off Like years like I'm buzzed Don't know what it costs Good price cause I'm plugged Plugged Fly to Puerto Rico Fuck that bitch, I'm one on one Say that she love me Cause you know that I'm one on one I just drank some lean And now I'm feeling kinda slumped Fuck you in the morning Shorty, yeah, I beat it Yeah yeah, I beat it up. I've been driven so hard, you would think my diamonds in a tub. Girl, I fuck with Goyard, but that money really fuck em up. All my songs, they go hard, cause I'm sipping off that fucking mud. I be off that fucking mud. Drink, drink, I drink another cup. Uh, these tracks revenge, call me 21. I just bought a Benz, I need another one. Ten, six, smoking, yeah. So you got the extra play time. Oh, no, no, you, it, it was good. I liked it. Yeah. I enjoyed it. Yeah, he, yeah. He flew to Puerto Rico. Fuck the bitch. You know. Yeah. <laughs> Shout out to Zins. Um, look, my I guess my general take on this one is like I was just into the mix. I was like, okay, so I, what kind of? T- I, I, sometimes on d- certain songs, I listen for different techniques. So delay throws, harmonic saturation. You know what I mean? Not to get too crazy with it, but like, um, I heard a little bit of that. Like it was a little wet. You know what I'm saying? And that's the terminology. Let me just clarify. That's the terminology. That's because he flew to Puerto wet. Rico. You know what I'm saying? He flew to Puerto um, Rico. <laughs> it was a little, like, respectfully, like, dry. But I did hear a little bit of reverb in there. But I think to, to really, like, unthin those vocals, adding a little bit more reverb, some a little bit more color when it comes to, like, the dynamics of it. And one thing I did catch in there, it's on SoundCloud, so I don't know if it's ready or not, but um, the plosives, like, the, when you say it, plug, you heard that like a little bit, not a lot, but it was like a, it wasn't contained with the de-esser. You know, they probably need the stronger de-esser on there for them plosives. But like, I mean, that that's super technical. But I mean, I, the beat was dope. It wasn't a, a bad song. The mix it doesn't need like a ton of things. It's just like my new, my new tweets. You know what I mean? Or tweets. Right, 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 right. But that being said, I'm giving it like a solid three out of five, or two point two point nine out of five. Two point nine out of five for sure. I thought it sounded dope. Uh, I agree. I think it could have been a little more clear because uh, I, I know that's the sound that they're going for, that little uh, kind of echoey or like a, like a auto-tune-ish kind of sound. Right, right, right. But I did, I did think it was, I mean, it was some stuff in there. I like he switched into the Antecupo ball and he said yeah. uh, some things that, you know, the out Buzz Lightyear thing I thought was cool. He switched. I personally thought it was running and it was almost like a hustle and flow where he was going so long, I was waiting for like a dope hook to come on. And I don't oh, yeah. know if I just missed that or not. Like I, I wanted right. like a, I wanted him to get to a, a ending point and just drop a dope hook and then keep it going. So right, uh, it sounded just like a long kind of kind of rap. Right. Um, and so I, mean, I didn't think it was bad. Like, so I said I would give, I would go about two, about two point eight. I mean it was it was it was a, it was a solid showing. Just missing a couple of things. I think it could definitely be fire if he added a few more things in there from my perspective. Right. 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 What's good, chat? Yeah, he kind of a little skies ish, little little Tekka ish. You know what I'm saying? Which I like both of them guys. But go ahead, go. Yeah, no, it was good. I enjoyed. Um, I, it, you know, it, it was good. It wasn't great. It wasn't something like I'm gonna keep on playing over and over and over again. Um, and tonight, like, I'm, I want to hear bars. I want to hear bars. I want to hear. I want to hear. Um, I want to hear originality. And I want people to sing. If you're gonna come through, sing. Open your mouth and sing. <laughs> right? Like, please yeah. sing. Yes. Um, you know, it, it's been a minute since we've had somebody that's actually had like, blown us away. So um, that's what I'm looking for tonight. So that was that was okay for me. 2.5. 2.5. All yeah. right, cool. Um, next up. All right, we're doing one-minute plays. We got a couple more songs in the free block, and we get into the, the pay line, because I see the pay line absolutely taking over tonight. So, so we got uh, Pablo the One with I Can't. Okay, are we going to Pablo the One, I Can't. Uh, is this a beat, Pablo? Let's see what we got. Um... Uh, 658. I got it right here. An attempt was made. That's all he said. <laughs> An attempt. Any good. chance uh, any of y'all got rappers and shit my, uh, for my produced EP? Uh, dope young producer right there, by the way, in the chat. Um, yeah, we we definitely get into it uh, today. Uh, so send something in. His, his new name is VBS Ren, by the way, if I'm if I'm if I remember correctly. Amzai with the memory. Yeah. So we're going to Dropbox with uh, for Pablo the One. Shout out Pablo. This record is called I Can't. Uh, he said this was an attempt. That's all he said. So I don't know if it's a, a beat or a rap, but let's see. Here we go.
right so that was a minute right there pablo's joint uh i can't uh so i wonder what he said like he said that there was an attempt made i wonder if he what kind of attempt he was making right right like it was like a technique and that i maybe i just missed or a type of instrument or something you know what i'm saying or a new plug-in that he found and used I'm, I'm i'm curious but um you know uh you know pablo has been cooking lately you know this one um from the previous pack um i did enjoy those beats a little bit more but this one was just kind of damn i don't want i don't know what word she was but i don't want to say run of the mill i don't know if that's the right terminology it was just it was just like it, 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 it didn't move me here, here or there. It didn't have that BPM compared I'm looking to where for right now. Compared to where he's been. Had before. I'm not going to lie again. Uh, like, again, today I came I came in listening to... This is what I've been, I was listening to. Yeet dropped a new EP. So my mind is like energy, energy, crazy noises, sounds, yeah, futuristic yeah. space, 20, 20, uh, 2099 type shit right now. You know what I mean? So I'm, I'm, I'm Tron right now. If you ever seen the movie Tron, like that's where I'm at right now. Next Eclipse. Please. 20 years from now, Next Eclipse. For sure. That's where I'm at right now. So that's the kind of vibe I'm on right now. So that that didn't that what that didn't meet me there but um it's, you know just you know i know pablo can produce so i'm not really you know this one my favorite so i'm giving this one like a solid it was like a 2.5 out of 5 for me for this one i think it could have been dope i did like how it came in that the beat pack that doo -doo 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 -doo, when it came in i thought that was real hard um i think the the I guess piano or, her, or the organ sounds. Mm -hmm. Like if you if you take that off and maybe do something else with just that B pack, I thought that would have been like crazy. The organ kind of threw it off a little bit because it was, it, was it, it gave me a, a good like solid beats, but then I, the organ. I mean, I don't know what kind of song I would do to that because the organ right. sounded kind of like 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 I got the Eminem or it was, it was a weird way of like how right. you would flow a song to that. But right. when it dropped, I was like, ooh, that beat that 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 bass pack was tough. But I so I would get I, mean, I would go about two point five. So I think it's potential there, but the, the organs and stuff it just didn't yeah. fit. It was kind of loud. It just kind of like I, I interlude ish. Yeah, like, like interlude, interlude -ish, like something like that. Movie ish. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. Yeah, Gallon. Um, 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 Pablo, I'm waiting. I do not waiting. Uh, do you play the piano? Do you play any instruments? I'm kind of curious. Um, I'm okay on the beat. It was a three. Uh, it wasn't the best that Pablo sent in. Wasn't the worst. It was kind of right in the middle. So I can see anything like between like y'all saying two point five to a three. So I'm at a three on it. Um, you know, Pablo knows we love him. Pablo it can do amazing work. This one sounds like it was just kind of like there. You know, it wasn't it wasn't his best work. So. Yeah, he's right. Like, said the temple's made, so you know he, yeah, you know, he, right. he was trying something new. Yes. Um. So with that being said, uh, I, I heard I saw Wavy's message. Right. So he's got the nine seventeen, the one that one that just came in. Right. Mm hmm. So this one's called Rich. Because uh, he was actually next up in line too. So. Yep. All right. Um. So we're going back to SoundCloud. Y'all might hit a commercial. Just bear with me. Oh, no commercial. This is Wavy. This record is called Rich. Never seen before, I can't rub your back, kiss your neck, open doors, know you had a long day, so I know you need some more, more affection and all attention, set the president, later on we wrestling, cause I apply that pressure in, I could throw some presidents like Benjamin and Franklin, do this fucking shoe, I'm stacking up, just know I'm banking and switch, let me deposit it, I'll acknowledge it, and some proud of shit, you're the one I'm proud of with. Let me show you things you never seen before. I can't rub your back, kiss your neck, open doors. Know you had a long day, so I know you need some more and more affection and all attention. Man, these headphones are so fucking honest, man. <laughs> like, I, it, wow. Like, it let me know, like, so much it's like data at this point going in my my, my like my ears like audio like it's just like it's telling me every like it's telling me like what happened in the eq like everything so damn okay now i feel like i want to get some new headphones because this is like just now just i'm just hearing things that just gonna sound like i'm just like ah, 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 you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. um but for me what i heard is like tons like low end gone like in the in the vocals mm. the beat was dope i love the beat of course lo-fi vibes kind of chill youtube <laughs> playlist girl <laughs> anime girl type shit you know what i'm saying love that um to me like the 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 vocals 
Now, this was intentional, totally different. I wouldn't know that, but just from listening to it, I heard like there was some frequencies taken out that maybe shouldn't have been cut on for me. You know what I mean? And this could be just a demo. So he, he, this could be just like the first stages. I'm probably talking like the, this is the last stage, but this is probably draft number one for sure. But I think it's, so going into draft two, it's like adding adding data back to the the vocals like you know what i'm saying adding more low and not like warm tonal low end not like boxy or muddy low end just like that where the your vote the male vo voice kind of just naturally has i feel like that was cut out a little bit here but um and then there's no dynamics really when it comes to like flare or reverb things to create space like something like that uh, again i think this is like the first one um Something, something. <laughs> no, 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 it's good. But I, I definitely like the beat was crazy, though. You know, the good thing about like practicing on this type of record, like you can get some real good like like practice in because uh, even if it's like two tracks, the beat and the vocals that he recorded, like you can get some real, real practice in, like really fine and fine tuning things and stuff like that. So I'm at like a solid. I'm at like a two two seven with this one. I'm at a two seven. Mainly because of the mix. These headphones are absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, the sound that y'all got going is crazy. So yeah. I feel like I'm listening to music in my, like, in the studio when you get ready to record. So everything is, like, yeah. where I can really, really get a good grasp of it. Uh, I thought the beat came on fire. I thought mm -hmm. that I was like, damn, that beat, that beat was crisp. The beat was, like, very well. It wasn't over bassy. It was real clean, real clean. And then he rapped. And it, it was it was a little off. Like the the I think it came on a little late where I expected what I expected it to drop came on a little late and it was kind of like it, was, it just wasn't as clean. The, the beat was so clean I expected the rap to be really clean right through there, especially with that slower pace of beat like Lupe Fiasco type. You got to be really clean on those slower pace. And so I I, I would give it, I would give it about a two point four. I mean it, it, the 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 song the lyrics could have been better. And I don't know if that's a clarity thing or just for me, it felt like a uh, like a timing thing. It was just off a little bit, kind of jumbled up, merged some words together, mm -hmm. jumbled some words together right. at times. So it uh, could have been a little more crisp, but so 2.4, 2.5 for me. I think he asked the question like dry. Yeah, definitely dry. And I think like, I don't know why people talking about their ears ringing. If your ears are ringing, definitely ear fatigue. And hopefully people are mixing loud. Remember, I think a lot of engineers, I mean, everybody has their own technique, but I think a, there's a high percentage of engineers that mix low. Cause if you hear, if you listen to the song loud or they're like blaring in your ears or you have like low quality headphones, you're just listening to noise, I promise you. Yeah. Like you yeah. can't hear the things, that, oh fuck, I heard this little thing, let me take that out. Oh, I heard this little pop sound, let me, you can't hear it if it's like loud, you can't hear that shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So mix low, you know what I mean? Go ahead, Gala. Amzai, the word that you said was practice. Right. And the, the only reason I'm giving this over a three is because I see that they are literally practice. I say they, um, I'm not saying wavy, but they are literally, I can see that, I can see what they were doing. Like I could hear that they're fucking with the plugin. I could hear they got a better microphone. I could hear that they had headphones. Like he's trying to figure out what his sound is sure. uh -huh. because, but he hasn't done that before. And so, like he said, it didn't sound like this two hours ago. So he's like, okay, cool. So now we got like this thing that we're bouncing back and forth. So I'm at a three because it, he's practicing and he's like kind of breaking, he's getting away from the mold and what he's used to, which is going to make him better. So when you fail, you tend to do stuff better. I'm not saying you failed, right, right, but yeah. I think this is a, a success for what we've been asking for, in particular what I've been asking for, which is the salmon with the crawfish etouffee Ooh. on top of it. You know what I'm saying? So you still got a ways to go. Shit. But I that's could, a great I point. Could, I could tell that I could tell a huge, huge difference that you're truly trying. I mean, we can say that because we know Pablo. Um, but the, which is you mean a great. Wavy. I mean, excuse me, wavy. Which is which, which? Which makes it a really good point. What you said. Yeah. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I've heard you. Uh, yes, man. The conversations of let's go YouTube chat. I love it. I love it, man. I love. I love. I love the YouTube chat, bro. Y'all yeah. be y'all cooking. Keep keep uh, keep brewing. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you hit the like button and share the live. Yeah, um, share with your groups. mama, your daddy, your yeah. cousin, your uncle. Yeah, we're gonna do like a in, in a couple of. Oh, we got God, we got three things. Two two three things coming up here pretty soon. So anyway, we'll get to all that shit. Yes, we will. Um, 
Damn. The okay. crop. Thank crawfish. you, sir. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So next up, Gavin, who we got, y'all? Um, we got uh we got four more minutes. So it's okay. We got one more song. Um, hype, hype or hyperx? Hyperx. Hyperx. Or I hyperx. feel like I remember this. Song. Hyperx. Or I mean hyperx? this artist, Hyperx. All right. This record is called Mania. All right. So no notes in here. Uh oh 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 yeah because yeah. Pa that's uh Pablo the One's friend. Ah okay yeah, okay yeah. okay. So let's see what we got here, y'all. Um. Let's Mania. Mania is an interesting title. So For you know, sure. Which way that's going? On? With 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 what's it called? WrestleMania just happened as well. I did I did watch a little bit for I haven't watched wrestling like goddamn twenty years. Yeah, Some just said like, look at WrestleMania. I'm like, oh okay, damn, look at the stage, wow, the lights, oh it my was god, crazy, it was bro, it was insane. Yeah, I was like, wow. Let me say did you hear? Time. Did you hear the Carolina? I was talking about it yesterday. I did, I did, I did. It Man, did. my whole family, we've never ever as a family watched wrestling. Yeah, but my sister is dating a doctor, and he literally grew up on ra on wrestling. He said his role models and his male figures are all from wrestling because he didn't have a father. Dudes wear tights. So, like, yeah, no, he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> he comes he in and he lights on you. Hulk He's Hogan. like, we, we got an RK, uh, what is it, RKO, this this uh, cancer out of your body and shit. You know what I'm oh, saying? Oh, man, right, but, for sure. No, he's, but you set up and watched it, and a lot of people said this, is that The Rock made, like, he came back. I was watching the clip, The Rock beat somebody, and they're like, okay, clear, because they were talking, like, clear, like, cut. Oh, and the Rock said, oh, the Rock said, oh, hell no. He said, clear this. He says, this is what you get. This is what motherfuckers get. And he, like, took Cody Rose's blood, put it on the belt, and it said Mama Rose on it. Like, oh, yeah. the Rock went, like, hell He, he was the antagonist. Shit. Yeah, he set up his whole thing. Because, you know, when he comes back, he's always the good guy. So he yeah. came back as the bad the guy. The final boss. And he, you know, he definitely played up to it. You know, Rock is crazy with his, you know, his monologues and things that he does. And so it, it was definitely, you know, he definitely played it up. Shout out to The Rock. Um, okay, so this is HyperX and Pablo the One. This record is called Mania. Here we go. Oh, I like that snare. I like that beat. Got the Santa sleigh in there. Potential. Yeah, I wasn't mad at that. There's this artist that I really, really fuck with, man, that a lot of people don't talk about a lot, but he did get a lot of shine with his the song he did on the Apple commercial when the uh, Chargers are looking for the wall charge is looking for like you to plug something into it. Uh, uh, Doughboy. Doughboy out of Ohio. Like, Doughboy is fire. I think he's still signed to Futures label. Free bands and Doughboy got he got records, man. And this this definitely sounds like uh, a Doughboy uh, B for sure. Like you know what I mean? Yeah, y'all. If you don't know who Doughboy is, uh, check him out, man. And then I, I would say focus on the production. Like usually his beats are like they 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 do good job with the beat selection, you know. Um, so um, you know that that immediately reminded me. So th 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 this. Uh, song gets a little bit more credit because I could hear somebody like immediately. I'm like, okay, cool. Well, if the right artist gets on this, it can totally change the dynamic. Some beats is kind of hard. Like, mm. not saying like, because I don't hear anybody, the beat isn't fire. Or I, it doesn't have dynamics. But this one, I'm like, oh wow. So I can definitely hear somebody. So in the studio, how I would imagine this? Like, so if this record was to land in Doughboy's uh, studio session, it would sound totally different because of obviously Doughboy and HyperX would send Doughboy, I mean, Pablo the One and HyperX would send Doughboy the stems, right? So they got the whole stem in the session. Shit's being moved around. This is taken out. We're replacing that clap. We were replacing the Santa Slayer with another type of, you know what I'm saying? So it would evolve completely. So that's why I think this, this would be dope as hell. 
Um, I'm definitely like at a high 3.6 with this one for sure. Uh, now with vocals and it like going through that evolution in the studio, probably higher. Like I'm talking about app, app, like crazy high. So what'd you just give it? It's like a three point. I'm gonna say three point seven okay. actually. Three point okay. seven. You know what I mean? What do you think, Flu? Uh, I thought it was. I thought it, uh, the intro came on. It reminded me of that Metro that dun 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 dun, and then it just drops. So right. I thought the intro came on real crazy. Uh, had some good transitions. It wasn't like it's was that dun dun dun, and then every now and then, like you said, throw in the Santa sleigh. Then I heard a couple of switch ups and things like that. So I did. I thought it had some potential for sure. Uh, it definitely has to go to the right artist. I don't think anybody could just jump right. on it and get on it to make it fire. So it got to go to that type. Like, though, we got to go to that right artist. And if it does, I think it. I, I mean, I heard like Trippy Red. I mean, I heard like something in that for vein sure. on that. Um, yeah. So I thought it was. I thought it was good for for the right. Like you said, I, I think same thing. I mean, I'm more, I'm more like a three. Um, but I do think, like I said, with the right artist on that, it could be four or higher. Mm. For sure. Damn, they talking about a beat switch. Damn, I, I missed it. Shit. He said it was well, probably, it was probably it was yeah, it's probably after. We missed it. You know. Wow. A little bit later on. In but the I mean, song. it definitely was. I said, came on great, had good, clean, you know, transitions. I thought it was pretty dope. Damn, I kind of want to. Let me, let me just see. Hold on, y'all. Yeah, it's back a little further. Okay, hold on, hold on. I got. I, I, I have to do this for them real quick. Okay, hold on. Okay, I hit a mania. Oh shit! Yeah, see, I like that. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, but, uh, yeah. Ooh, I like this. Yes. Yeah. And it's really the same thing. It kind of you can hit a dun dun. It's really sped up a little bit. So right. I like the transition Ooh. of that. No, okay. clean. I'm, like, I'm, clean. A, I'm a star this one for you. Oh, I'm a star that way. I'm a star that way because I the beat, you know, they, they he knows I love beat switches. So go ahead. Uh Ghana, what's your t- general take on that one? Weird. Well, I, 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 I guess your you yours is gonna be different because you're at the we Yes. Put- so um, <laughs> <laughs> No, the mania, the beat switch, the bang, like yeah. Um yeah. I've had a four point two on that one. Now I don't know. I guess they work together on these beats. Mm-hmm. Um, but that is this is a definite combination. Um, Cause if I'm not mistaken, they've done some other stuff together, and I like that as well. So this is a definite combination that I fuck with. So 4.2, I liked it. Shit. Shout out to Johnny all the way from Australia tuning in. Yo, Johnny, shout out what's up, Johnny, baby. Man. What up That's with you? Is he? Where'd you tap in at? Uh, it was way early. I just oh, forgot, okay, forgot okay, to okay, uh, okay. reach back out to him. But uh, Johnny, what up? Hopefully all is well. We need to do a show dedicated to Johnny, maybe. Man, did you see? Oh, I think we talked about that. Did you see Panifa Seal Samoa got signed, t- got picked up to be on a festival? No, I didn't see that. And then somebody else dropped out of um, one nine, one nine, right? Four, one four, one four, one four. Yeah. And is now a preacher. I think he said. Oh wow. In the last mm-hmm. show, yeah. So. Okay. Yeah, man. Shout out to that guy Panifa Seal Samoa. He was like this dude that just like could sing, bro. They now he's doing festivals. I'm like, yo, we know that guy, y'all. That, that. I just see you guys signed the festival. That's great though. Yeah, a big festival, man. Yeah. Uh, a lot of big worldwide artists on there. So next up, I guess we go into the pay line. Let's go. Let's man. go. Let's, see what we Let's get now, it. Now man. this is when we got people that submit it. You know, they believe in their shit and yeah. they say, you know what, we gonna make it rain. <laughs> we gonna make it rain. Put the, put the money into it. Yeah, so we got, we got 10 here. We got 15 here. We got a little bit of that. So, again, thanks, everybody, for subscribing. Yeah, I like I that. I like that. <laughs> yeah. Let's I go. I got to do it at the right time because Amazon being a soliloquy. And I know. I'm like, like, bro, okay, come on, please. Please, <laughs> please let me feel that. Yeah. Let me cook. Set let me cook. Up. Set them up. Let's go. Yeah. All right. So um, $20 paid line starts off with Rencon, then Mr. Fresh. Um, then we got the, those are two Insta skips, and we got Soul Powell and then Perry Lawrence. Oh, right. I think Pablo sent in. Yeah, yeah I, I think I see something. Okay. Shout out to uh, Coachella, man. Um, damn. I seen Tyler Critter a long time ago. That shit was crazy. Um, listen. Oh, look. So, listen. Let me just talk about my picks real quick, real quick. So, look, I've been listening to coming to the studio. I listened to Yeet. Uh, it sounds crazy saying the last name loud. It sounds it just sounds weird, but like, yeah, he dropped a new EP. I really enjoyed it. Like, it's a, it, it's his sound is definitely not for everybody, but I actually enjoy it because I'm beginning to like, because I sometimes I do runner gigs, so I'm working with like people that come on tour down, like big artists that come tour at the uh, the Frost Bank Center, and now I'm starting to look at shows like in music, like production. 
You know what I mean? Like, how? what kind of lights and pyro can we use to this? You know what I'm saying? You know, you know me already. So, like, when I went to the Drake show, I'm like, lights, pyro. You know what I mean? That, like, it, it just is different. You know what yeah, I'm saying? You know they going to so the surface. So, ye Yeet is just like, uh, everything you can just see. Fire, flames, laser lights, all that shit like that. Dope ass shit. Shout out to Glitcher <laughs> So I've been listening to that. Bryson Tiller just dropped a project that is like absolutely fire, y'all. Like, and I've never sat down and listened to a Bryson Tiller project in my life. Absolutely enjoyed it. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Bryson Tiller. Check out that project. These are my picks. And then, of course, uh, Cowboy Carter, man. I, no. I, I just barely finished it because I was listening to the song a day. I was like, wait two days, sit, like sit on it, think about it, play another two songs. Like that's how good that project was. I thoroughly enjoyed Cowboy Carter. I think it's going to be like this monumental project just just absolutely encapsulates, like just encapsulates like a time and then it just locks it. You know what I mean? She's, it's a stamp for sure. Um, And then something that I, I want to get into is before we get started is I, has anybody seen, you know, I'm going to have him look it up. Oh, you funny. Everybody go look at the Party Next Door EP cover art and tell me what y'all think about it. Party Next Door. If you know who Party Next Door, just type in Party Next Door on your DSP, Apple, Spotify. Look at his new project and let me know <laughs> what y'all think about this cover art. Have you seen this cover? I'm going to show Flu while y'all look at it real quick. Bro, that's his cover art. Wait, hold on. Damn it. I didn't want to show the to see Look. So somebody posted that, that and I didn't know what that was. So Party Next Door is, a, is, a, is an artist signed by, uh, of course, Drake. Bro, that cover art is wild, bro. I've, wow. I've seen some crazy cover arts in my life. That one is it. Now, depending on the song, <laughs> like that's, this is right in right up this hot girl summer alley. So that yeah. that they no pun put intended. The, yeah, Whoa, put the right, no pun yeah, intended. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like no, no I'm intended, sweating yeah. like if, hey yo. Like, I can see females as crazy as it sounds seeing that and being like like. I want that's me. Like I want to like live my life. Like I can see them just going so crazy I with that. My life. Yo, Not real, no live. I want to live. I'm like that's me. I had so many females say like I want to go on vacation. I want to be on a fucking balcony. I want to do like you. They just the energy sometimes they be having it. So I can see if that song is fire. I can see them tapping right into that. It's, it's a four song EP. I can't wait to listen to that shit, man. Just because I'm of that cover art. I think it's you know fire. what I'm saying. It it's reminds me of it's low be key music. of uh, Drake's Drake and the Twenty One Savage Club where they had the girl with the grill and it yeah. just kind of popped. I Whoa, thought it was way more hurt? sexual, but it's like it was just something. It was just it was just popped up and you just it said everything right. without saying anything. We just want to know who that girl was, basically. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, who is she? Who is that girl? But hey, yo, part next door. Hey, hey. That cover art fucked it. <laughs> you definitely like, gonna hey. press play. Yeah, yeah. Else like to party on her is. back. That's all I'm saying. Listen. So. <laughs> Just you know what? I just you know I'm just I'm just curious. I'm just trying to see how, how that shit made it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, just do the for it, right? Hey, yeah. That's what I do. Hey, I mean, as long as it's you've covered. You've seen by far worse with some of these other. Yeah, things, you're right. So. You're right. You're right. It ain't that much further than what um uh, which one, Mr. Fresh be put in. Oh, that's true. But you know, yeah, yeah, you're right. Um, <laughs> so let's get into the uh, pay line. So those are my picks. Uh, Check out the Bryson Tiller. Check out the Party Next Door. Check out the uh, Yeet Project if you into that. Um, all dope stuff. Uh, but we get into the paid line. Um, like Galen said, Rincon. I'm not sure if I've seen his name before. So Rincon sent in a drag in called seen. Glass Tables. Rincon, tap in if you're in the chat, homie. They said Rincon, rising artist from Dallas, lyrical artist, and brings different vibes through uh, throughout the year. Headlining next show in Dallas uh, at Club Dada, you know. Uh, just recently performed with Paul Wall. Okay, let's, so let's see. Hey. Let's see. Here we go. We going. We are going to Spotify. So let's see what we got here. Um, from from Rincon again. This record is called Glass Tables. Okay, let's see. Oh, you know me. I always here we go. All right, so we pay line. We full song right now. <laughs> Gelato wrapped up on these glass tables. Hit that shit again like selfies from a bad angle. Uh, no, I ain't signing to these rap labels. But I myself wrote a dice like some crap tables. Bitch, I'm the jackpot. You ain't even on your own team, Brody. You more like the mascot. 
You rappers faking than some mad shots. Healthy spirited, but can't lose to my bad thoughts. Got it out the mud, still brushing all this dirt off. Life's a picture straight, throwing me some curveballs. Room of silence with a mic to get my words off. My whole flock fly as fuck, hit that bird call. Feel the breeze underneath my wings. Like a giant sleeping dog, I got bigger dreams. Bird's eye view, shorty, that's my favorite scene. I'll go broke to succeed, and that's by any means. Long as the outcome is income. Make some bread and get some head dog and then some. Lost a few times, but it made me get my wins up. True stories when that paper and that pen touch. Y'all be holding the fake personas if all fails. Instagram posting stories telling tall tales. You can't even catch a buzz like a mocktail. I'm drinking heavy to help me get through these dark trails. If I don't do it, then who gon' do it? Are you gon' do it, nigga? You too influenced. Tripping off this rap music. Your guys don't know how to chase it back. My guys, we get straight to it. If I don't do it, then who gon' do it? Are you gon' do it, nigga? You too influenced. Tripping off this rap music. Your guys don't know how to chase it back. My guys, we get straight to it. Straight to it like a drag race. The beat's slow, but lately I've been living at a fast pace. Money talks, I'm familiar with how cash takes. Got money low like a broke bitch's gas tank. Uh, don't talk to me about no work at no work. I've been driven since day one. Y'all curb checking. Heartache and heartbreaks be the worst lessons. If I would have known, I would have ignored the first message. Uh, grass is greener on the other side. Now it's greener where you water it. Keep that in mind. Yeah, we all got a story, but shit just more than mine. Yeah, more than mine. Gotta die a thousand times to see my roads alive. My roads alive. On the road, scene switching while I'm beat listening. Uh, uh, Suit and tie, suitcases, how I mean business. Uh, uh, I stay hungry, I'm still eating, my meal's different. My meal's I know different. we all made the same, but shit, I feel different. Yeah, I feel different. Oh, you hearing me now? Man, y'all bandwagon. I say ten toes down, and now they can't stand it. Gripping the rap game until my hands cramping. They see a Mexican rapping and think it's outlandish. Something different to the world, like a fifth season. Like a fifth season. I be living my lyrics, man. Y'all lip syncing. I got a book full of verses for when I meet Jesus. How about y'all give me my flowers while I'm still breathing? If I don't do it, then who gon' do it? Are you gon' do it, nigga? You too influenced. Tripping off this rap music. Your guys don't know how to chase it back. My guys, we get straight to it. If I don't do it, then who gon' do it? Are you gon' do it, nigga? You too influenced. Tripping off this rap music. Your guys don't know how to chase it back. My guys, we get straight to it. All right, y'all. So that was Rincon with um, Glass Tables. I mean, I, got a lot to, I, I think I got a lot to say. You know, it's crazy. It kind of reminded me of um, obviously the beat was fire. Let's just start with that. The beat was fire. The sample was dope, smooth, well produced. Um, he kind of reminded me of like G Easy. You know what I'm saying? He kind of reminded me of G Easy a little swear, bit. That's what I was about to say. <laughs> uh, <laughs> which, you know, I like early G Easy. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, know, he was like only really on some bass shit at that time. I was like, yo, I like I like this guy. You know what I'm saying? So um he definitely gave me those vibes. Um, you know what's crazy? So now in my algorithm on Instagram, I get like a ton of fucking engine music engineer stuff and like techniques and VSTs and all this stuff and one thing that I never what up, hey Rincon's here. What up, Rincon? Um, one thing that like so just taking the hook, right? It kind of a lot of it was a lot of things going on. Like it almost I, I, I don't want to use the word polarize or polarization, where things were canceling out or phasing out because they're the identical, they just stacked on and they sound so similar. But I was watching this technique. This technique's been in existence for eons, but like I've never did it because I was lazy, but um side chains you know basically where I, I got a vocal track i'm creating a bus with the plugins on it and then one of those plugins activating the sign chain so it, it reacts to certain things that are happening within the beat you can do it for or other vocals so it creates like a somewhat of a ducking effect or like harmonic effect to where um like both sounds are prominent in the mix because it's 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 uh it's doing something this this technique is doing something to make it not like counteract to each other so like uh vilely you know what i mean so um side chain or mid chain all that shit like that super technical stuff but that's what's drake that that's exactly what drake and his team is doing with some of these beats how they how his vocals so like effortlessly stands outside of the fucking um 
uh, of the beat. You're like, God, uh, why, how does this sound so clear? It's, it may, uh, first of all, they're using Million Dollar Studios, but they're also using techniques called, you know, um, they're using a lot of side comp uh, parallel compression, fucking side, comp uh, side chaining. Side chaining, phase, phase canceling. Mm. All that shit, man. Yeah. So, um... Over, I said all that to say, like, yeah, that's that's it was an okay mix with that being said, you know what I mean? Like, the, it was a cool song. I, I think I'm definitely like at a um, like a 3.5, 3.4 with it. Like, I wasn't really like moved by it as the first song I'm hearing from, from Rincon, but I do know that he probably makes pretty dope music just based on that right there, you know, side chain there. Mm -hmm. Uh, yes. Go ahead, go ahead, Flo. I thought it was dope. Uh, thought it was clear, like the 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 the. So I thought the the verses were clear, and I thought the verses the hooks should have been done the same way the verses were done. I, I right. feel like the hooks stacked a little bit, and so it like it did give that doubling effect. Um, so I thought because the hook, I mean the verse, and when it came on, it dropped. It was clear. It did give me G easy, uh, but it dropped. The beat was dope, um, and then the hook came on and it kind of doubled. Uh, so outside of that, I think that took away a little bit from the song, uh, but it was a dope mix, dope kind of concept. Uh, beat was kind of fire. Uh, had some lyric points in there and things like that. I mean, I've really listened to lyrics and things like that. So uh, overall, I thought it was good. I mean, I th I'll give it about a 3.5, something I could listen to okay. again, and, you know, but it has to, that, that hook part, I, I would personally clean up. I think it should sure. be more clear on the hook. I concur. Go ahead, Galen. Yeah, I, I can square with everything and, and, and agree with what you all are all saying. Um, my overall take on it was the the um, the the rhyme was not writing or, or the lyrics weren't lighting writing on the on the track. It got kind of it, not muddled, but it was just it was in there because like as I said, it was so much so many other things going on. Um, the beat was amazing. I thought it was a little long, um, but it has some bars. It has some really, really nice bars in there. So that's where I am with it. I'm a 3.5. Yeah, and that's out of five, five, guys. So just let's let everybody know. Like, yeah, that, these, are, out of five. these are all wonderful um, scores. You know, it's not, you know, not a one or it's just right, right in the middle. You know, so shout out to Rencon. Looking forward to hearing additional music from you in the future. The hook was phasing. That's what he said. Phase, it was a phasing issue with the hook. Right. Right. And that, and that maybe that's what I'm saying. You get uh you can hear that, you know what I'm saying? Uh, so that's where that came from for me. Like I said doubled up a little bit and mm -hmm. the and the, the verse was so clear and so like on beat and then the hook kind of doubled up and spaced out a little bit for me. Mm -hmm. so. But shout out to him performing with some so, some big artists, man. So keep cooking uh and keep sending music your way. We're, we're, uh definitely trying to hear like the versatility in your in your in your content. Shout out to Rincon, y'all. Um, and everybody, put your IGs in the chat, man. Put your IGs in the chat if you haven't already. Uh, put your IGs in the chat. Like, we, we definitely trying to link up and follow the San Pluto show on IG as well. That's where I be at most of the time, all right? Yeah, um, definitely post your IGs, man. Somebody, man. somebody else may be listening and was like, man, that shit was... You know, fight, you know, everything was good because it was a good song. So, I mean, shit, post your shit and let, me, let people know where to go get it. Absolutely, absolutely. Um, all right, man. So let's continue. I think we got Mr. Fresh next, right, Galen? <clears throat> uh, Mr. Fresh is next. Mr. Fresh. All right. So let, let me see what I'm I'm excited to see what Mr. What Fresh's album art cover is. art is because he be sending some wild cover arts <laughs> too. So don't let me down. Um, have y'all heard him before? Yeah, he sent this some music uh before. Um, from I think he's from Anchorage, Alaska, if I'm not mistaken. Um, this record is called Yo Chick My Type. Damn. Damn. You know what I'm saying? All right, so here we go. We want a SoundCloud. I'm pretty sure we're going to hit a commercial on this, so y'all just uh, hold tight, okay? Bear so, with us. Yes. Is that your bitch? I better come get it. Okay, so no commercial. <laughs> um, see, <laughs> uh, Mr. Mr. Fresh, Fresh is dog, crazy. Like... Yo, what up, Ryan Goodrich? I haven't seen Ryan in Yo, a minute. Ryan. God damn. And let's put a poll in the chat. What y'all think about J. Cole's apology? This is a question for everybody. What y'all think about J. Cole's apology? And we'll talk about it on the other side of this record right here. So y'all get y'all 
responses ready. Here we go. This is Mr. Fresh, yo chick, my type with the wild cover art. He's always coming through. Yeah, can't stop swiping. I'm a known stiller. If you're trying to keep it, you better be gone with it. Can't trust me around a bitch like Bobby was wrong with him. Wait. I'm like, well, Mac, I know. You might need a low jack because I jack. Wait, who's this? Show connect like Tic Tac. I got like Grizz. That's not Mr. Fresh. My type like AB, AB and O, nigga. She get it. She yeah. tight, she yeah. tight. She obey like, okay. like a spike, like a spike. That's him. She do what I like, what I like. Your chick, my type, my type. She thick, she tight, she tight. She obey like a spike, like a spike. She do what I like. What Shout I out like. to Skype multitasking. My type, uh, have no fear, Mr. Fresh here. You can hate, I'ma keep it clear. I'm gonna keep it clear. Join the club, don't be a scrub. You just mad cause I get love. From your chick, she be jacking. She cute, her boots, I'm knocking. I be knocking. Uh, on the regular. Every day she hit my cellular. Every day she texts me. Every way she sex me. She wet like a jet ski. She wet like a Pepsi. <laughs> she thick, she tight. <laughs> she obey me a like Pepsi, a Sprite. Bro. She do what I like. Yo, chick, my type. She my type. She want to drink. She looking nice. I'm going to buy it for a right just to see what show they like. Listen, if I didn't, I'd be tripping. She a thick and tight print on the mitten. Had to play a smitten. She looking like Robin Gibbons. No stress. I'm going to play it Mr. Press like Clinton. Few times I almost fell apart Think about her arts Looking just like a question mark Truly Wonder if she likes movies We can head to the spot Watch a Tubi while I rub the booty But I can't say that That's what she asked me If I had my own spot We can stay at Told her yeah Now you're talking if I'm not gonna lie The beat kinda slap Rooftop apartment now The beat kinda right Yo, yeah. Bottles in the fridge Let me take her to the crib And give cutie here the biz Love She thick She tight She tight she obey like a spike, like a spike. She do what I like, what I like. Yo, chick, my type, my type. She thick, she tight, she tight. She obey like a spike, like a spike. By the way, all, every she one of his cover arts is like, just a different, like, I cheat model or something. Type, <laughs> every cover type, art. My type. Yeah, that beat kind of crazy. I like that. Mm. Mm. The hot hats. Yeah. Chime yeah, they that, got the, it, he got the scratch in there. Okay, yeah. <laughs> so that was Mr. Fresh. Uh, yo, chick, my time. <laughs> God damn, it was good. Like the rappers, that was a. Hey, I added that. I like that pace that they brought to it. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying. Yeah, I really yeah. like the pace, and it almost sounded like they were elsewhere, and he recorded yeah. on his setup. Yeah, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? Because that's that general Mr. Fresh sound we used. To, <laughs> we're normally here. Right. So, right. Mr. Fresh, let me know. Like, Am's I was like, where, where's Mr. Fresh? I was like, oh shit. What the? <laughs> yeah. So, I, I didn't hear that tr that 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 traditional sound. So, let me know, uh, Mr. Fresh. That, like, did somebody send that track to you already ready? You just kind of threw the hook on it. Um, I, again, I, from the rappers, I did like the pace. Um, it it, it was fun. I don't want to use the word parody, but it it, it 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 was it was it was a fun record. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Not not mixed well. You know what I mean? But it was uh, true to form when it comes to Mr. Fresh. All his records, you know, boom boom boom. We 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 know what we gonna get. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, but I, every time I always tell him like, I want to know where he's pushing the records. Is he doing what I, I told him to do? I told him like, bro, uh -huh. uh, maybe you should start submitting your songs to like like porn podcast like you know what i'm saying because his songs remind me of that music you used to hear back in the day like with them the, <laughs> the sounds like before whatever whatever you know what i'm saying so it's just it just i don't know but uh that was mr fresh y'all uh yeah three different studios goddamn okay so three different studios mr motherfucking um, fresh worldwide you know what i'm saying so <laughs> every, everybody had their own studio everybody yeah, you can, <laughs> everybody had their own studio sounds. you can definitely hear that man so um shout out to mr fresh i mean yo chick my type that's the name of the record i'm definitely like at a solid i'm, I'm, I'm just for the fun it's mr fresh i'm at like a, i'm at a two nine bro i'm at a two I'm at a three. I'm at a three. I'm gonna give it a three, y'all. I know. I'm gonna give it a three. It's Mr. Fresh, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Mr. Fresh. <laughs>
Uh, it definitely gave me a West Coast vibe. Right. Uh, so I, I was feeling that. I mean, in that time frame, like a West Coast vibe kind of thing. Uh, it threw me a little bit because I know, Ms. I guess, Mr. Fresh, the second person came on. He was a little more low key. Brought it down. And gave me the West Coast vibe. The first dude came on. I thought he came on with some energy and and he kind of like he, he had a Bobby Womack kind of mm-hmm. line or something in there. So I thought he came on. I thought he came on really short and then it jumped back in. So I thought it was. I thought he was pretty. He, he started off well and then it, it, it kind of rolled at that point. Um, so I mean, it, it was, the beat was fire. Um, West Coast. I said it gave a good West Coast vibe. I, mm-hmm. I'm looking like a, I'm, a, I'm like a 2.7. I mean, just because I I, I felt like. Um, it got lazy with the third guy. It kind of got lazy a little bit, but I thought the beat was fire. I thought the, I thought it was like I say it was a, it was a vibe. I could see somebody in a fucking six four, kind of just right. bumping that shit and low rider bouncing or some shit like that. Um, but that's how I was at with it. I thought the first dude came on with the energy and the energy just kind of switched a little bit. So that was just me. It looked like he's you know he had Louisiana. That was the first guy. Alaska was Mr. Fresh, and then the last guy was Cali. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Just everywhere, like gumbo for real, for real. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Go ahead, Gallo, with your take on that. Yo, so I always give Mr. Fresh, regardless of the mix, regardless of anything else, because I would actually say this, outside of like some of the, uh, damn, this is gonna sound fucked up, but some of the amazing producers and artists that are extremely consistent, mm-hmm. Mr. Fresh is consistent on what he does each and every song he sends. It's consistency. And so for that, I give him a three, <laughs> even though like it is not the best mix, but it's a three. It's so it's judging on a bell, uh, bell curve. However, today, I always say I'll give Mr. Fresh between a three and a 3.5. Today, because he stepped out, this is the first time we heard somebody else. I made a 3.6 on this one. The beat was fire. I thought the dude that was rhyming was fire. Um, if Mr. Fresh cleaned up his his end, I think it could even been higher. So today, 3.6 for Mr. Fresh. Yeah. Um, don't shoot me, people. Hey, y'all might not <laughs> like it. I like Mr. Fresh, and this is who he is. He's raw, and it, it's it's he's going to be who he is, regardless of what anybody says. Yeah. So Cat shout Williams could come talk some it. shit, and he's gonna still be a three. I ain't mad at it. Shout yeah. out to Mr. Fresh, man. That's <laughs> you know. <laughs> Um, all right, so it looks like we got a uh, glitcher for next. No, oh, we got Pablo the one. We're, oh, with a twanky, really? Yes, sir. I thought we did that. Um, okay, no, so uh, I saw that one too. That was uh, okay at 843. Got you. So I, I got the Pablo joint. Uh, this uh, the title is My Reaction When My Computer Overloads and I Had to Close the Project. Damn, that's that. That's that. Hey, damn dog! I don't have that sound on here no more. <laughs> but then that you hear that window sound that. I'm like, oh shit! <laughs> like no. Or you walk back in, your shit restarted. You're like, wait a minute, why did my computer restart? It, oh. Shut itself down. The, the window just closed by itself. Like, <laughs> damn. You see what Pablo said? Y'all ain't hear him. He said he's I wrong. It. I saw. It. <laughs> no, this was wild. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't start that, bro. Like that shit was crazy, that it. Um, so this Yo, record- did you see Brianna? You know she got her tire messed up, right? Uh, Br- Brina. Brina. What'd she say? And she said, "Damn near two hundred dollars for a damn tire." Uh, what's a good brand of bicycle? And I <laughs> oh, said, she's funny. I said yeah. you could have gone to tire. I for said real. you could have got a tire for forty dollars at Lopez Tires Number Four. For real. And man, I had, man, I had a couple of holes and you made a couple of patches in it, but hey, yeah, I don't it give ain't two hundred. It you know, ain't two hundred. You better pay for a tire and a rim. And that's you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Damn. Alignment, balance. Uh, you know what I'm yeah, saying? And yeah, she said, yeah. "You're right. Two hundred. Two hundred. Nah, I ain't, you no, ain't no way in hell. Nah, I, I roll on three tires and a donut before I pay two hundred dollars for a tire." That's hey, why I got yeah, bad luck with cars. Listen, there's a grip. Somebody I, saw you coming a mile away. I'm gonna say this. Look, I remember like I was in the '87 Thunderbird, and you know I would go to the, the, the those type of tire shops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like every week, I was getting a new tire. <laughs> I wasn't yeah. paying 200 I was paying like paying 30 about, Yeah, 25 But like every bucks. week is like pop, boom, ah, bubble. You know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> There was one time week. I had like three different tires and two different sizes. <laughs> oh, no. <nah, that> was... <laughs> hey, it worked. Shit. <laughs> Burning gas. Like, boom, boom. Um, look, we got OK um, uh, by uh, Pablo the One. Again, we got Flu in the building. Yes, um, sir. Ski. Y'all make sure to go uh, tap in with him on all platforms. I just put his... Um, his uh, social media. Oh wait, is it? Did I hit it? 
You put it in earlier. Yeah, you did early. At flu season 83, you know what I'm saying, on all platforms. I don't okay. see it, Amazon. I stopped pressing the button. I know. Make oh, up. shit. Wait a minute. Hold up. What happened? Oh, okay, no, there it is. Shard A. Okay, cool. Shard A is tapped in, but for some reason, mine's not working either. Oh, damn. Damn, we're fucking Elgato. Here we go. Mm-hmm. Let me play this joint from uh, Pablo real quick, man. Can I cut the... Okay, let me cut the beat off. Here we go. Take uh, flu on this beat by Pablo. Uh, I thought, I mean, again, the bass that that came that doom, 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 the, the, the knock came in, so I mm-hmm. could hear that knock in the car. For me personally, I wasn't huge on it. Um, I think it could be great for the right artist. I could hear some like Tech Nine. It's like one of these kind of guy, guys who kind of really jump on those, you know, type of tracks. Um, so it's definitely tailored to a particular artist. Uh, I thought the bass was good. The switch up kind of threw me for a second. I don't know where you would go with that if you was rapping or recording on that. Uh, so the switch up could have been left out for me. Uh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm around like, I'm a, I'm a 2.4. 2.4. It, it was okay. Listen. Um, yeah. 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 I wasn't swayed by that one. Did like the change at the end. Like that little segment where the, like the reversal of notes or half whatever half notes or whatever yeah, like that that little went. segment yeah I like that right there um, but yeah this one was just kind of you know kind of it didn't move me this way or that way you know what I mean so but it wasn't a terrible beat it just I just wasn't like it didn't make me lock in you know maybe there was a snare wasn't snapping as like crispy as I wanted or something just make it, my attention wasn't drawn in not that I was focusing on anything else but I just wanted it to captivate me more um i'm just i'm at a solid i'm at a solid two nine right now at this one uh what do you think Gallen? yeah i'm at a three on this one um i you gotta it, be high <laughs> I, I, i'm always high because i i listen to like it, it for me it's i'm not a musician right mm-hmm. like i've tried fucking around with beats before i probably could be decent if like i really took my fucking time to do it oh um, uh, yeah for sure but you know, I I, I, I I don't look at it as much with a technical eye. It's more like how I feel. Mm-hmm. Um, but what I noticed on this one is it was like two different, completely different beats. But I don't know. I did like this one. This was a little bit more of what he had been doing. Mm-hmm. Um, but I didn't like the end as much as I liked the beginning. So, yeah, solid three. 
Solid three. It reminded me of that other one too. Like I feel like I like the bass. I like how it came in. But when you go too far with the piano sounds, for me, I feel like you could take that piano, that dun, 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 take that out. Yeah. Put something else on it and lay mm. that with that the solid bass sounds. I think that could have like drawn me in a little more. But when it starts to piano over that bass sounds a little churchy for me. And so it kind of threw me a little bit. I did notice some influence from and he he probably never admitted, but from another producer in the beginning. And we got it. We got another <laughs> producer who's been on the show. He and said I'm like, never admit it. <laughs> and um, I'm like, dude, this this cat's. So I I see Pablo being influenced because Pablo is a competitor. It's in his blood. And every time another producer comes on, Pablo steps up his game. It influences a little bit, and he becomes better. So I like seeing that in Pablo as well. Yeah, the bass was crazy. Yeah, the yeah, bass. yeah. All right, so it looks like we got uh, Glitcher for up next. Is that right, Gullen? Yes. Okay. So yeah, I got some of the best names out here. Like some of these names are yeah. like really unique. Yeah, get, really, it's truly, truly like little biscuit, little little. Pablo. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it was another artist back in the day. I was like, yo, remember he came on with like that little. It was like little, and he had like little <laughs> pimp, little pimp. Remember? <laughs> Yeah, was it? Yeah, little pimp or some shit like that. Some, some, some stupid shit like that. One of my favorite ones is Alice the Goon. Oh yeah, she fire. Yeah. Alice the Goon is fire. Alice the Goon. Yeah, yeah. Flu. You right? Never. You really sit down and think about it. We got flu. Like yeah, you really. You, it's yeah. One syllable. They just they like you know, yeah. something the great and like these names are pretty cool. Well, yeah. I mean, like listen, yeah. you got look. Amzai is just Amzai. I'm just Guilin. Like them <laughs> names ain't fucking normal to begin with. So. Nah, yeah, yeah. So shout out everybody with dope names, exactly, man. That, exactly. that are like and we can read them too, by the way, because some things I'm like, all right, man, they got numbers and shit, and I'm like, okay, I don't know. Um, but we're going with Glitcher, man. So, real hip hop London. Ooh, okay. So, Glitcher is a producer. They, they, he just upgraded his equipment. He's been producing these really dope beats, a high energy. Um, and I'm excited about this one. He said uh, he wanted to get. Uh, wait, uh, want you guys to think of, think about what you guys think about this beat? Sorry. Uh, thanks for all the support. Excuse me. Uh, so he just wants our feedback on his beat right quick. All right. So we're going to SoundCloud for this one. I haven't got a commercial in a while. So let me. Hi, there we're visible. Is. The wireless company with Smoke nothing. It there it is. Yes, um, you know what? They don't let me do that. I got to wait. Um, so it looks like we got one commercial, y'all. So make sure to share the live. If you haven't subscribed to the channel already, do so, man. And uh, share. make sure to tap share. in with everybody. Share. You know what I'm saying? Don't cost you nothing. Don't cost you nothing. Thursday? Support something. Yeah, today okay. is thir Thursday. Here Thursday. we go. Thursday. Oh, 
I feel like I can hear somebody on that. I was, yeah. Man. Yeah. So let's talk about who we could possibly hear or something like See, that. See, y'all like are music wise. fans like that, but this is the first time in my head, and I don't even know who I could hear somebody rapping. I was like, I could hear like bars being spit. I could hear a girl singing. I could hear a woman singing on it. It, it kind of felt like a hot girl summer track almost with like that clap booty over. clap. Let's see if you feel, if you feel like if you see, I feel like I can hear Tiger. Damn it! Damn it! I was about see to play it safe yeah. and say Tiger because <laughs> you know his beat. Ah, yeah, I can't. Yeah, like, 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 real high. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 And he loves yeah. records like these. Yeah. You know, it's like real. Fun, safe, exactly. Like big, and I, I feel like I, I feel like I heard Tiger on that. Fuck it, throw Chris and Tiger on it, like mm-hmm. you know, with some nice breezy. melodies from uh, mm-hmm. uh, Chris Brown. Chris yeah, Brown. breezy, yeah, Chris yeah, yeah. That, that you can hear really hear Tiger on that. Yeah, yeah. And then yeah. jump back into something he go on with. Like, Bro, yeah. Um, man, I'm trying to like. They actually, well, Chris is going on tour with Money Long. I'm like, God damn, I want to go to that shit. Yeah, um, sure. I never seen Chris live in concert. And I know it's going to, my girl wanted to go see like Jasmine Sullivan. But I'm like, no, like, yeah, no. Know, Chris, Chris is more. Like, no, I love, love Jasmine, but she's opening up for Maxwell. I'm like, why not go to the Chris show with Money Long? Come on. Yeah, Chris, anyway. Chris is one of the ones. It's like going for to sure. Drake. Or like Chris yeah, he one of the ones for sure. So yeah, I can definitely hear Tiger on that one. Beat production was great. Like, I mean, I like the way the subtle, the sample, when it was not like the forefront of the, like the beat, when it went to the back, you heard mm-hmm. it like the, it kept the bounce in it. Like it was like a hi-hat or something. It was crazy. So shout out to the piano, the, the, like the, everything about the beat was dope. It was very dynamic, tons of changes. I mean, it was well-produced, quality was great. Everything was warm, crispy, and the clarity that we, I'm I'm used to hearing from uh, honestly Glitcher for like, honesty. So that's the that's the big things for me is it's usually warm and clear. You know what I mean uh, with Glitcher for, and I think he, they take tons of pride because I, they may be playing actual synths in the com, in, and then com, going that converting that in, or maybe they're playing this MIDI. You know what I'm saying, controlling the uh, VSTs or whatever. But either way, super dope beat. I'm at like a. This might be, yeah, it's my first five today, man. It's not, it just, it, I know it's just a beat, but it was just so well put together. It was so well mixed. I'm giving it a high score because y'all know I great how mixed, man. So what do you think about that, Flo? I thought it was fire. Uh, the piano, like I said, the breakdown, the, the, um, the ch- 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 that reminded me of like some Drake would throw in to that like, rich baby daddy or so you know that that pause where it was the build up. Right, right, right. Definitely could hear a Tiger. Like I said, it sounded like it sounded like one of those beats that you would hear somebody put and they put the face by it's a Tiger type beat. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Tiger type beat. I thought the, the breakdowns was good. The lead ups to, to back into the song was good. Right. Really clean. Really good. Really clean. Piano really clean. Kind of went a little long on the first break, but I still thought it came back in clean. So it was up there. I mean, I definitely would. I would say I would, I'm not going to go as high as five because uh, Tiger's a particular artist. I don't think right. anybody could get on it, but um, <laughs> definitely Tiger could get on it and make it a hit. So I, I'm going to go like 4.3. I thought it was up to four, about a 4.3. 4.3. Okay. Gallon. Yeah, it had me going the entire time. I'm at a 4.8 on it. Um, not far from a 5. This is one of those ones I'd really want to hear somebody on it to jump to that five, right? Like, right. that's the only reason. Okay. But it was a great beat. Um, I thought it was inventive. I, I thought it was kind of original, too. I didn't hear, definitely, like, definitely. I, I, there were some pieces in there that we've heard on other things, but I'm not mad at it at all. I'm a 4.8. 4.8. I would give. I would go five if I could feel like, like, if we were both artists in that, we would be fighting over this. Be like, I need, I want that one. Yeah, and sure, that doesn't sure. mean that it's bad. It's just, it's just perfect for a particular person. Right. So when it's perfect for a particular person, that's why I didn't go five from right. my perspective. Gotcha. The other thing I thought is it yeah. was, um, it was, it was out the box, ready to go. Right. Out the like, box. Like somebody, like you can just jump on it. Like you could jump on it and go. Where you wouldn't have to make a whole bunch of changes or anything else. So. Yeah, and the first like I think I can't remember exactly, but at first two or three seconds it, it just was kind of sl- and then it just jumped on. So I thought yeah, like, right. when it came on, it came on. I was like, yeah, okay. Shout out to Glitcher for I thoroughly enjoyed that. Uh, you know, per usual, 
looking forward to hearing something else in the future. Uh, what it is, DJ Lynx? Uh, what up, DJ? We got some people in here. What up? What up? Um, we are going to uh, slow, slow, S O L pow, pow, soul pow, sun soul power, maybe. Pow. Let me. Solar power, soul power. Formerly soul known power. as solar powered oh, animals. That's what, I got. that's what I got. Solar power. Oh wait a minute. Solar power animals. Yeah, what is that? That wasn't the one. What was that group? Remember our song, Leave Instead. What was that colorful group that was in the that was in the forest? Yeah, running around. Yeah, he says, yeah, we are the two uh, piece band, both 19 years old. Lyrics by female vocalist, production by myself. He said, if you remember our song called Leave Instead, this got to be them. That was them. I think it was them. Yeah. Okay. So they sent us another track. They 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 (laughs) rebranded. They mm-hmm. rebranded. It's the called. Block. <laughs> uh, it's called Mind Games. All right. So their production was really dope last time, um, and I was very impressed um, by the mix. So let's see what they cooked up this time. This record is called Mind Games, and they're under their new uh, name called um, Soul Power. Soul Power. Here we go. <laughs>
listen, man. Super young individuals here, y'all. Hmm. So <clears throat> they're um the, the band members, two piece band, <clears throat> excuse me, they're 19 years old. And the lyrics was a female vocalist. They they produced everything themselves. Everything you just heard was uh, uh, produced by these uh, this this young group here. So nineteen man, listen, <clears throat> light years ahead. You know what I'm saying when it comes to the mix. Um, obviously, my favorite mix of the night uh, with the beat and vocalist uh, Glitchfer was the my favorite beat um, of the night. And of course, um, this one here is the the tandem. So. The vocalist absolutely came through clutch because sometimes it's, it's kind of rough. Like when you got a dope production like that, notes may be off and mm -hmm, like it's mm -hmm. just it's rough melodies like it's just. But I think they 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 definitely executed uh, what they were trying to achieve. I would be I would want to know if they felt like there was something that didn't happen that they were trying to achieve in the mix. But overall, for the sound, I think um, they probably like, hey, we did we did that. Like we executed what we what we wanted to get done uh, confidently. So uh, very warm tones. I mean, there was a whole bunch of things, especially at the end. She's like, na 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 da 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 da. I loved it. You know, Gallen was playing a string. It was a violin of some sorts in there. It was some a, string um, instrument. It was a bass. I'm pretty sure. Oh, cello. It was a cello. I'm pretty sure it was a cello. One of yeah. One I of the string off instruments. Here. It was like here. I was like, oh no, it's here. <laughs> something. Yeah. Something. So. Overall, absolutely fire record. I was thoroughly impressed with the mix. Again, in these headphones, I didn't really hear like something that was out of place. That's what I, these headphones are. Lit. It's like something. It's, I don't. I gotta. I gotta learn more about these particular uh, monitoring headphones. But it's really telling me where everything is. Like literally, like it's either here, 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 here. Like, and that one was just like right here in the middle. It wasn't like out of place. Like it really lets you know where the the mix is. But this one was just perfectly imaged in my headphones. You know what I mean? Um, I really liked it. So overall, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Man. Noni? Damn. Um, I think I'm like, whew. I would be lying. I enjoyed it, man. So I, I'm at a five, y'all. I'm, I'm at a five. I'm at a five, man. I'm at a five. I know. I know. I know. I know. So. I thought it was dope. Thought it was dope. Uh, in the beginning, I ain't gonna lie, for me, I felt like, like how when you like for me it's like it's a rapper like when you rap it's, it, the guitars it kind of was clashing sound like like uh, like more than one thing happening at once but it's not that i didn't like it it just it was like a lot um yeah. but uh i thought the, i love i like the the content the song i personally felt like i heard it like i could see this like i felt like i was watching a movie like okay. a movie scene at for the sure. end yeah, where the guy sure realizes he short film for loves sure. the girl and he's chasing and, yeah, yeah, yeah. and all this stuff was happening as this so I definitely could see that on a film I think they should submit that for some film or That'd something that would yeah. be hard film festival, um, yeah. the lyrics I thought like I said was good it was a great song um, definitely like the end that end part as well um, like the voice and everything remind me of kind of a Alanis Marset kind of thing like it was it was, it was a real you know uh a vibe on it and so i would say i was a solid 4.5 i thought it was really good and and in 19 i thought it was really i thought it was really good really really good really different and really good so indie folk is the uh the genre is that what they're saying indie folk indie indie folk yeah and it's crazy they said they really unconfident in they mix which I mean, which is that's is ultimately gonna make them uh, better, you know, and focusing on those, the the small yeah. things, you know what I mean? Sure, sure. It's just always to make it better. But from for me, I think the mix is at a great, great point where it is right now. But I'm pretty sure um, there's always something, you know yeah. what I mean? And that um, comes from experience. They 19, yeah. so I'm not saying it was a bad mix. I just think no, that. Sure. Like if you were with a professional, they may give you some pointers. I take this, add this, da, da, da. and so this is just things that you just don't know, right? Because you know you're not, you know it's just the process of it. I mean, shit, I'm still going now, and people may be mixing. They be like, well, should take this out. Da, da, da. That's what they are professionally paid to do. So right. that'll get better as you get along. It's not that it was bad. It was, I thought it was really good. Uh, but uh, yeah, I thought it was good. I thought it was good. So would you give it? Four point five. It okay. Really okay. Um. There was a challenge in the mix. However, <clears throat> because I'm not a mix god by any stretch of the imagination, I just listen to Amzai most of the time. <laughs> no, I'm getting better with it. Um, but 
right when I was getting bored because I'm thinking, damn, this is long, they could switch it up. Right. Every single time I'm like, it's getting bored. And this could be in a rom com. This could be, um, you know, in, in like any any type of TV show that's out there. Mm-hmm. I really, really, really enjoyed it. I loved her voice. Um, reminded me of Ani a little bit. Like, you know, we got a friend um, that's a friend of the show, Ani. She could be on this. Um, their production style yeah, is Ani. indie folk, but it was it was current. It wasn't like when I think indie folk, I think, you know, a little bit older, a little bit more folksy. This was fun. It, it, I really, really enjoyed the fuck out of this shit. Five. Yeah. five. No, yeah, five. this is like, five. like, so folks, it does, it, it does make you think old, but you know, think of people like Fiona Apple and shit like that. Yeah, like, yeah, you know yeah. what 100, I'm saying? 100. You know, um, yeah, it's, 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 or Florence in the Machine type, you know what I mean? Like, the other vocals are r- wonderful, but yeah. like, yeah, it, yeah. And I, I can, can only see imagine folk. like this in a studio studio. And like a pro got their hands on this. That's what I'm saying. I think it's some little it would tips be that somebody could like do to the next level. And I, I just agree. heard, I just saw a movie. Like even those weird scenes where you have like something like Deadpool where it's a lot of action and blood flying, but it's and a song it like got a crazy Bruh. song like that. Yes. Crazy yes. Song. Yes. In slow motion just yeah, chopping them over. Chopping people's <laughs> heads off. Or, or, uh, or yeah. the other one, um, Joker's Girl. Samuel, we got uh, it, Samuel. Uh, we got it. Uh, uh, Haley. Uh, 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 yeah. What, what's Joker's? Yeah. What's, what's Joker's? Yeah. The Joker's girl. Oh, that was uh, Harley, Harley Quinn. Quinn. Yeah, Harley, 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 it was a yeah. scene she had like that, and we were she was shooting flowers and things out of. Yeah. So oh yeah, that shit was it, hard. It just, yeah, it just reminded me of like that's I just saw a, a good movie. scene. They're probably like, yeah, that's not what. <laughs> but no, that that is a good ass like um, point there. I love that. Um, yeah. Alice, like imagine Alice the goon coming up with like a concept for this shit, like. And we, we, we you, it flew. You got to see Alice Agoon. Mm-hmm. We, like, we showed this, this girl there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck everybody, it's bro. just, it was so wild when she <laughs> came up with just fuck. She's like, fuck the industry, you know? Yeah. And she just went in hard. But this was, I really, really like this. I, that yeah, was, was Soul good. Power was nice, man. It was good. It was Soul good. Power was nice. Soul Very Power. nice. So, I would like to hear another record. I would like to just hear more from them, so. <laughs> 100. Yeah, listen, yeah, we're a fan. Cool Keep kids. on sending. Keep cool on sending. Kids. We're a friend. We're a fan. For sure. Y'all tapping with us on Instagram to the Sam Pluto Show. Um, putting Flu's uh, Instagram handle in the chat right now as well. Um, so next up, we got Perry Lawrence and then that new skip from um, Sam uh, Samuel as well in the chat. All right. And I think that that, that would close out our... Okay, hold up, hold up. Go so ahead. we got uh, Perry Lawrence. Yep. We got D Malicious. And then we got Samuel o Enola. I got you. Okay, and o- cool. and Olia. And as soon as we get done with the pay line, we're going to play a record from Flu as well. 100%. Let's go. All right. Um, <laughs> Luckily, it won't be 11.45 at night. Man. Yeah, oh, yeah. Let me, let me. <laughs> my bad, Flu. Dude, we want to make sure we don't go past your time on the show. Either. Like, let us, know, let us know. Let us know. Let us know. I'm here. You know what I'm All right. Y'all, y'all already know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. I, I was All prepared right. for this. You know what I'm saying? All right, here we go. (laughs) (laughs) Um, damn, oh Perry Lawrence, there he is right now. So Perry, man, always comes through, shows mad love uh, on the show. We we appreciate him a lot. If you're on TikTok right now, come to the YouTube channel as well. If you're on TikTok right now, come through. Um, This is Perry Lawrence. Uh, This record is called Designer. Uh, He said, "Love you guys, man." Shout out to Perry, man. Thank you, Perry. Thank you, Perry. Much, lo- much love for sure. So here we go. I'm about to play this record. Oh, did he upload it? Let me say, hold on. Let me oh, so uh, you know what? Uh, uh, I got a SoundCloud link right here. Hold on a second. Oh, you got it? Okay. You cool. don't have a link? No, no, no. It's, it's, I don't have it. Unless he sent two. Did he send one or two different? Um, because uh, I, I got see... the email pulled up right now. Oh, shit. It. Hold up. That was, I think I was on Mr. Freshest. Yeah. So Perry, if you're watching, you may have to uh, send that that track in again because we, I think you submitted it accidentally without the link. Yeah. So, unfortunately, so, Perry, there is no yeah, link no, or no download or nothing. We go to the next one. So D, was it D? Uh, D malicious, D malicious, and perk on my own. On my own. All right. So okay. Perk. So interesting. Where we going with this one? So let's see. Uh, D malicious and featuring perk on my own. Here we go. In my zone, telling me you love me, but you know that you a hoe. You can't ask my mama, nigga, I've been living wrong. She just wanna fuck me, cause I got it on my own. She don't wanna fuck me, cause I got it on my own. Yeah, and yeah, I really like you, but I gotta leave you alone. Something just went left, and I can't tell right from wrong. Hey, bro, I know your text, why you blowing up my phone? I said it's of a bitch, why you won't leave me alone? I'm married to the double cup, in love with styrofoam. Yeah, shorty's 
bitch, I'm getting high. Sipping on these all these drinks, you know I'm gonna fly. Off a different bitch from LA to Illinois. When I do a show at Rolling Loud, I'ma make some noise. So the nine and hell key, I never play with toys. Bitch, I'm flexing cause I'm rich, I really didn't have a choice. Yeah, your bitch look like a Civic, and my bitch look like a Rolls Royce. Yeah, I fuck a pussy up, not that shit, I like I'm Floyd. Yeah, I treat it like it's war zone, yeah, I kill and redeploy. Yeah, I'm always overthinking, yeah, my money search and destroy. I was broke, didn't have a dollar in my pocket. Roaches running down the wall of the apartment. We were starving, I had to kick the door in. Can you be honest, the feelings I had lost them. Yeah, you know what's crazy? I heard a, so clearly the guy, uh, one of the guys, is inspired heavily by Juice World. Uh, um, and definitely heard <laughs> You know what I'm saying? It heavily influenced, and then and then the other guy kind of sound like he's part of. You know, I like this group, 88 Glam. You know, that's like a group that it's like oh, you talk to someone like oh, you know about 88 Glam? Man, that's crazy. Yeah, but um, you would know some random ass. <laughs> group. Nah, they dope. Though, They're probably so. not that random, but <clears throat> nah, they 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 dope as fuck. Um. But yeah, mm, it just sounds too like standard. You know what I mean? Nothing really exciting about it. Um, it. It just, you know, and sometimes that's not fair, you know, but because there's a ton of artists that's popular to making a ton of money that sound like a yeah. lot of ton of other artists. You know what mm -hmm, I'm saying? So mm -hmm. it's just like sometimes it isn't fair, but like. Um, at this point of their their career, they're probably trying to cultivate an audience. They're trying to captivate attention. You know, probably not utilizing anything that they could marketing wise to do so. But it's just it's it's rough, man. It's rough because that's that sounds like too run of the mill kind of like everybody else kind of vibe. And I, I don't even really like saying that because it doesn't even really matter. But it, it, you know what what pathway are we taking to kind of get heard? You know, again, I don't know any of the analytics. I don't know what. What hot spots they have around the country, I don't know, but to me, it, it, it may be a struggle. You know what I mean, um, respectfully. But with a good mix, it don't matter. That's why I think the mix is so critically important because it's making an impression. Even if you sound like Juice World, which I'm a huge fan of Juice World, I, I still think to this day Juice World have been one of the biggest artists the planet Earth has ever seen ever. You know what I'm saying? Planet Earth. W when it comes to sales, everything. You know what I'm saying? Um, so RP him, um, but yeah, I just, yeah. So if the mix was higher, I, my, my, my take probably would have been totally different if the mix was a little bit better, but not saying it was worse. I mean, bad, but it just wasn't, wasn't crispy, you know? So I'm at like a solid, I'm in a solid three. I'm in a solid 2.93. I'm, I'm, I'm swaying in between those numbers right now. So Maybe, where, where I'm, at a two, I'm at a 2.9. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Yeah, and yeah, I thought it was uh like saying I agree. Uh, it was kind of running. It kind of sounds the same. And like you said, it's, it's unfair because. And so that being said, I mean, I think when you sound the same, it just depends on the machine that's behind you. Who's going to put you in front of some eyes and, right, you know, exactly. yeah. and let you be seen. Because otherwise it, it sounds the same. You know, how, how you look, how y'all present this, how what's the selling point on this? Exactly. Because it did sound the same, which is, again, if that's a sound, a sound that people like. Right. People going to love it. But, right. If they if they not putting you out there in front of people like that, then it, you'll get lost in the sauce. Exactly. So, uh, like I said, mix could have been a little better. Uh, you know, I, I didn't I didn't hate it. You know, I, I vibe to it because it's it's a it's a very consistent vibe that people right. go on with that. Right. Um. So. Exactly. What up? Um. Outside of that, like I said, it wasn't bad. I would I would go halfway. I go two point five. I think you know I wasn't I didn't hate it. I didn't overly love it because it was about the same. Word. Garland, go ahead. Um. <laughs> You know, I always talk about also Rans, like, who is this group going to be? They sound like somebody else. I thought the mix was kind of decent. Um, yeah, it, yeah. it wasn't, like, overly modulated. It wasn't too much too much um, on the, um, on, on, uh, what's that shit that I always talk about? Um, something. Anyway, something. Something. All right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Auto-tune. 
It mm. wasn't too too auto tuned. It it, it oh, kind of okay. fit like, like this weird pocket. I, I actually enjoyed it. I'm at a three point three on it. Okay. So um, where, where, where? again, I'm not gonna listen to it over and over again. It's a lot of stuff that we've been hearing, but I thought they executed well. Mm-hmm. And I think that's what I'm at, right, with them is it was a good execution for what they were trying to do. Yeah. And just to be clear, like just so because people are like, man, like how does Amazon take sway so heavily? Cause again, priority number one is the mix for me. That's how I rank music. Does the mix, is it mix crispy? Does it have these elements that I'm usually looking for? Can it can, can it go up against, you know, some of the biggest artists in the yeah, game? That's yeah. how, it's the impression for me. And then number two, does the song have a mid to high replay value? The song we just didn't, we heard didn't have a, like a, a replay value where I'm like, yo, run that shit back, pop, pop, again and again. It didn't have that vibe for me. And lastly, the type of mode I'm in. Like earlier I said, I kind of broke down some of the music that I was listening to coming into the studio. So my mood is kind of like high energy right now, high BPM, crazy drum patterns and shit like that. That's what I'm here today. You know, that, mm-hmm, that changes mm-hmm. daily, you know, so. Yeah, I feel you. Um, Max Zay in the house. Max Zay, what up? TikTok, what up? Um, no, Sade. Sade is quickly becoming one of the, one of our, I, I don't want to say a fan. It's, it's almost like, No you way. Know, she, she, no, I wouldn't say fan at all. It's like, cause she's like a superstar. She just be chilling for entire fucking shows. Community, <laughs> community <laughs> shaman. That's Dang. what I'm going to say. Like four or five hours, she just be sitting there and the drop vibe. in sometimes and like, damn, thank shout you, Shout out Charlie. to her. Like, absolutely. Yes. Shout out to yes. her. Community. We want to get titles and shit. Community. Yo, you like fucking. that shirt, huh, Max? Hey, what's up, baby? You know what I'm saying? I mean, it gives a vibe. Like I said, it gives something that you can just kind of, kind of put on listen to like you listening to the radio. You know what I'm saying? Enjoy My shirt? Covers. No, no, no. Not oh. <laughs> Yo, I do like your shirt, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is definitely popping on it, but yeah. just the podcast, the, the energy y'all thank bring. You, thank you. Like, you can just it's put fun. it on, kind of just you li- just listen to it as you drive it. I, I will. Oh, Sade, yeah. I have no life. Yes, you do, girl. Yeah. <laughs> That's, I, I, it, it kind of sound like sports like analysts after like if we're watching like a dope like uh hooping fast break outlet outlet slow mo like and that's what yeah so what happened was you see he did the outlet in the past it did the open like you know what I'm yeah, saying nah, it's kind of how I feel like down. after on our breakdown like I wanna I'm gonna come I'm gonna come to the show with like a blazer one day like a bright crazy color blazer like an orange bright as orange yeah, orange and I can't say I ain't trying to jinx it now going forward but yeah. I mean like most of the times when you hear this because people could just submit they I haven't heard anything that I just hate it. You know, so we ain't use the button, like nothing. So everything's oh, been true. been pretty like cool to a certain extent. I mean, I, again, it's easy to to say I'm gonna just do this music and da 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 but it means I, mean, I haven't heard nothing that was just like, okay, let's get this shit off out of the head type shit. So that's good. Yeah, I mean. yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo! It's a, woo! <laughs> yeah, don't be. Yeah, I had like, to put that out there. It's kind of like, like, yeah. yeah. like nurses when there's a full moon out, right? And you walk in there and, and they're delivering babies and you're like, oh, it's quiet. You know, you talk to your friend and the girl's like, uh, she's like, oh, nothing's going on. It's like, oh, it's quiet. Next thing you know, babies just start running yeah, through the door and shit, right? Popping out and shit. Bro, we yeah, yeah, be careful. Whoa. But, um, Let's well, continue. Darius, part, we yeah. got it. Darius, we got it. Go ahead, go. Okay, so um, Perry, we're still waiting, Perry. I don't oh. know where Perry went. We're still waiting on Perry, but we got um, Samuel next. Um, Any Roland um, just sent a song. Okay, so Samuel, real quick, thanks for the 10. Is this, or is this you or your artist, sir? Well, I don't even see it. Uh, it came in Any Roland. It's uh, 1024. Oh, that's that, oh, that Samuel? Okay. Victim Syndrome, yes. Okay, let's see. Let me. I can tell. Um, victim syndrome. Okay, let's see. Let me look at the naming convention of the song. Yeah, this this is probably this is probably something they did. Yeah, it looks that way. Okay. Yeah. So this is uh this so this is a, a paid uh, skip right here, guys. If you're on TikTok, come to the YouTube right now. Uh, this is victim syndrome by Any uh, Roland. Here we go. It's Jay again. I know I did you wrong, but don't act like you treat me right. You lift me up, but it tear me down. Mix signals, baby, I'm ahead of now. The red flag seem to be standing now. I see your true colors, no hiding now. I saw the sign, but I wasn't sure enough. Yeah, but don't play victim. Don't play victim. You weaponized tears I had in my soul, so don't play victim. Don't play victim. I gave you enough for who that I am, so don't play victim. Don't 
Last time I saw you, you were living up. Life in a low car with no remorse. Made my peace with it, I wish you left. Cause I'm really done with holding grudges. You steady hit me up right when you're bored. All you want is fun, don't want to love. Same cycle, it goes on and on. Mental hell, we grass, now I'm down to love. The world is wicked, so I wish you love. Can't find another me, cause I'm one on one. Couldn't be nice, but you acting up. I see you already moving on. I'm kind of everywhere with this one. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm kind of everywhere. <clears throat> Again, that was uh, any uh, rolling with uh, victim syndrome. So, under- everything about this was intentional. Like, of course, like the lower delivery of the, the vocals, um, like really kind of like, it's almost like, you know, he is it's like a, um, a, like an apex predator, like trying to like scoping out, like really everything is like nice and kind of like, um, so I get the intention behind the delivery for sure on this record right here. Uh, for me, the thing, so in the headphones that's giving me like this, this, this dry cut, clean, like audio, right? Um, it, it told me something, but on the speakers, it, it told me like, it didn't sound like bad because everything was kind of like mushed together. And of course, when I'm not, I'm not in an acoustically treated room or nothing right now, but it didn't sound as the way it was coming out of my headphones. So what was coming out of my headphones, it was like, um, I wanted more blend. Like, so I'm able to hear because it's, it's a little bit kind of quieter in my headphones. I, I wanted to hear more blend, more space, more air. Not that air where you recording like in a fucking, uh, fucking gymnasium air, you know, just that air, like the, you know, some type of reverb, sat- harmonic saturation type of thing, you know, something that makes it feel like it's just, um, it's, it, the vocals are just sunk in, not in a bad way, but just like it's sunk in, but spread out. Like I wanted to hear the tail end of certain things that he was doing to give me like, like, Oh, wow. Like, you know what I'm saying? That kind of vibe. But, um, overall, it wasn't bad though. Like I get it. I wasn't like necessarily blown away by the lyrics, but I liked the way that I liked the way he was actually delivering the vocals on the beat though, like that. Uh-huh. I like that. You know what I'm saying? Um, he created that melody for me. Um, so overall, it was a cool track. You know, I wasn't like it didn't like really lock me in like this the way I wanted it to, but it definitely had me paying attention a little bit. So. Shout out to any. I'm definitely like at a one through five, five being the best. I'm at like a 3.6 with this one. I'm at a 3.6 for sure. Yeah. Or 3.7, excuse me. 3.7, go ahead. I thought it was dope. I thought the beat was dope. Um, like you said, the lyrics didn't wow me. I did like the hook though. I thought the the ad libs and the, the things that were added to the hook, like don't play victim, don't play victim. Like, right, was, right, right. I really I really enjoyed the hook. Uh, I thought I said I thought the lyrics could have been a little better. Um uh, enjoyed the beat, uh, enjoyed the concept. I mean, I thought it was, a, you know, played well to the to the title. Uh, so overall, I, I thought it was I thought it was better than average. I, w- I would go three point two. I mean, uh, mm-hmm. I thought the hook. I really loved the hook. I thought the hook. I could hear the hook playing. Gave me some 
this is how you mentioned like Bryson Taylor a little earlier. Like it gave me real low, you know, intentional vibes. B was hard. Uh, just I said the lyrics didn't just wow me, but I was looking forward to the hook when it was coming back around. Though. I'm not gonna lie, I got I gotta. I don't know if this. I don't know if I if I deem this a pushback or not, but. But Bryson Tiller? Wait, no, you're not. So get, say that again. Say that. Say it again. The the style. What what, what maybe he was going for? Okay, not, okay, not, okay. Not, like like it was reminding me. I just like it's like how we say like a like Juice World type of record. Got gotcha, you, gotcha, gotcha. So the, the style of it. Yeah, it remind me of that that almost like that that uh the is it Bryson Tiller. Who was no? That's Jeremiah. Man, Jeremiah is more gotcha. what I'm thinking of. That J Cole Jeremiah song. It gave me that low kind of mm-hmm. vibe of it but uh i said it was, it was better than the average for sure uh and i, I did look forward to the hook so i, I will go 3.2 golly Thoughts? uh 3.2 as well enjoyed it um could have worked on the vocals a little bit more again i like people when they sing right and i think sometimes people try to be too cute with it and i just yeah. i like people that sing yeah and so yeah. that's where i am with it so not a lot to say on that one are you saying he should have sang on this? Or? He should have sang, sang. Yeah, I think he could have okay. blown it out. Yeah. Got you. Yeah, it did stay in the same tone the entire time. So maybe, cha- you know, adding a different tone of it or something. It was in the same tone the entire time. But I did, like I said, for me, when it got to the hook, that's when you heard extra things added to it. And so I, I enjoyed it. Exactly. I can, um, yeah. Okay, so that mm-hmm. was that Perry. Where the hell did Perry go? Man, maybe Perry's just showing love. Perry, I don't know. Perry, where you at, we'll, man? We'll, where we'll you find at, Perry? Out. Um, you drop in, we'll we'll get it back. So, all right. So we back to the. Well, we gonna do um, one by um, Flu. Yeah, we got Flu. We are gonna do Flu's record right now. Tell me about this record that we about to get queued up right now. Let's go, man. The album's coming out March, uh, May seventeenth, man. This is uh, one of my first favorites on there. Like I said, it's called Echo, uh, and it really just was a concept I came up with. With just you know, I mean, again, I'm a lyrical bar type of rapper, um, and it, it just gave me a. A concept of you know doing something dope but trying to make sure the right people are listening kind of thing so it, it to me the echo concept came from you know saying something loud enough that it would travel and eventually get where it needed to be so that's what that. the concept of that okay um uh vvs rims we got you coming up soon um but let's get it so this record we're about to hear is from flu this record is called echo right here we go echo Yeah. I mean, this shit is different when I do it, man. But I hear you niggas, though. Look. I'm sorry, hip hop, the way it is, oh, haters. So put me in the pot with some bacon soda. And throw me on the block, see how niggas froze up. Pistachios, planters, my flow is so nuts. This shit is nasty, my flow is so guts. These other niggas, but I'm feeling like so what? Smoke them like cigarettes to the end. They so what? I'm feeling like a surgeon. This shit is so up. I'm so up, they can't reach me now. I didn't hit a home run before they reached the mound. But I do apologize for the weight, no frown. See if a tree fell in the forest, would it make a sound? What if nobody was there to hear it? You get my point, that's how I felt when I spat these lyrics. But now the radio see my flow so serious. No arms, no legs, but you still gon' feel this. I hear it all the time. As soon as I step inside it, little niggas, little niggas. It's like solitary survival. Beauty in the beast, I'm just talking to the time. Like, like, feel like I took the pill from Limitless. I ain't talking to Dolphin from Sega Genesis. Tug of war, man, I just can't let go. I'm at the point of no return I'm about to fill the room like an incense So I guess the point I gotta burn See, I'ma make them learn They might as well call me Undertaker Paul Bearer, you niggas gotta earn I'm feeling like cash yes, I'm grilling for men And they all out of win Cause they know they can't match this Never let them win I will never let them have this Got the hood flipping out like a pissy mattress Fact is, that's who I do this for I make them see it's possible for them to get this dough I remember days I used to sleep on flows. Now I'm making niggas pay when they sleep on flows. I make a nigga lay if he creep up slow. No way will I ever let you reach my dough. I'm just asking who's there. You're a knock knock joke. See, I'm the winner. I don't need your vote. Call me your president. I hear it all the time. As soon as I step inside it, little niggas, little niggas, it's like solid. 
military survive. Beauty and the beast, I'm just talking to the time. Like, like, feel like I took the pill from limitless. I ain't talking to dolphin from sacred genesis. Tug of war, man, I just can't let go. Let go, let go, let go. All I hear is this is age, this is crap. This will fuck up your demeanor. It's the twin towers falling. This is Hurricane Katrina. Bless the tree. Right on time, so it's nothing close to FEMA. She don't like dick, I'm a turner like my last name. I'm a leader, I'm a blessing, some say that I'm a weapon I'm a car crash waiting to happen, cause I be wrecking Just open up your mind, it'll only take a second My flow will show you the light, all you gotta do is let it Even though I sell albums, I ain't trying to sell my soul For a plaque on the wall, saying platinum, saying gold I'm just letting niggas know, I ain't trying to be a god If one person say they felt me, then I feel I did my job I'm a one man on me, but I'm feeling like a mob And you fake and you phony, so you really a mirage Niggas put shit in your head so you really a garage This is me, this is life This is how a nigga does yes. Alright y'all, so that was Echo Echo by Flu <clears throat> Now was I was Garland, Garland what, what did you what did your what did what your what did your vocal sound like in it? Mine I sound thought, mine sound phased. Yeah, it went. I thought it was the vocal I, sounded good. Cause on the, it's I, I don't I gotta I gotta let you listen. Okay. Like when I put on, on the speakers, I heard the vocals, but on my headphones they sound phased. Like hmm, interesting. It's weird. You hear that? Yeah, no, I heard a, like a, it was like, so in the email, it, d- it depends on which one it was. That wasn't like the master version, so it could have been, it could have been one that was okay, okay, okay. in the email. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, version. I just want to make sure it was a triple. I was like, okay, what? Yeah, because it definitely <clears throat> sounded like a lead track, a little more lead on it in the, in mm-hmm. the initial of it, but I mean. Uh, but I'm going to just say this, the, the beat was crazy, of course. The sample's crazy. The is um, crazy. Yeah. It's one of my favorite it, 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 I just like the energy behind the beat uh, a, a lot. You know, that's that's a classic sample, obviously. But I like the way they flipped it on this particular beat as well. Um, on, on, the only thing that I heard was like, uh, maybe this was the a, a different mix, but like, um, again, my headphones, they sound phased. Mm-hmm. Um, which was interesting, uh, but on the head, on, on the speakers, and it must be because there's a button on the back of these speakers that I can switch mm-hmm. the, uh, not polarization, but I can switch the speakers, and maybe I just had them switched perfectly for it not to sound that way. Um, but overall, I mean, that that would be it. It, it almost sound like that could be like the, like, I don't know where did this, where this track fits on them from a sequencing perspective, but like, it almost sounds like it could be an intro, like, or... Uh, in the middle early. of the project, I think, well, definitely yeah, I early. think it's middle. No, no, it's middle. I think it is middle. It goes because in the beginning, I kind of going along with the story, but then it kind of, I, I think it's it's about it's about in the mid of a twenty. It's about eleven. Like it goes it goes right in the middle somewhere in there. Right. Okay. Right. I think that, that I think that's what I was hearing. Uh, Gollum, what was your take on the track? Um, I enjoyed it. A, yeah. A tad bit long. Um, oh yeah, we. That's gotta... the only thing. <clears throat> I like the Tina Turner bar in there. Yeah, um, really like the Tina bars. Turner bar. Um, there was another bar in Excuse there. Um, knock knock, who's there? I thought that bar was fire. Um, you know, so I heard some originality there. I enjoyed it. I, I really enjoyed. It. I love having the artists in front of us. Um, yeah. Too. Oh, definitely. I, th- I think we need to. I would love to do more live stuff, but we gotta yeah, we gotta get on that. Got to do a live um, show again. Man. Yeah, oh, yeah. Man. We've live done live show. We have a live audience in here. This is fun. Yeah. Oh, that was well, I'm saying those like those with him even yeah. performing though too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, so I, I want to do get a, that uh, down. Like a series before like, this, right before COVID, I was doing a live series shows at Breathe Lounge, and we I would just perform with a band. So I love a lot of oh, songs yeah. performing. With a band, with a band. Like, oh yeah, oh yeah. Like, I was so you can, a, man, don't know this. Man, listen, I will. I will, oh, he's I will had small a band table here, yeah. talk. Listen, I will. I will. That's that was the the concept of that. Cause I, and I would and I had everybody. I had Avar. I had uh, uh, Yoda. I mean, I had I had everybody. Okay. And I and I was like, scrap the music. Come to come to a sound check and let the band just play. I want to just see here. They rap. just flow. They, they just, just play rap. the beat and so, just flow. Yeah, everybody. Breathe saying, was at. That's the old Broadway bar. Old Broadway is, is bar. It still, is it, what, what's, uh, the, what's there now? <laughs> it was like Verde Lux or something. I'm okay. not sure what. Some change. Now. Yeah. Listen, Amzai. <clears throat> Amzai. Don't nobody ever take us up, take us up. 
What's up? Put that together and we will do it. I will. I, we do live band. I, I've did, I did a series of show live bands, and we yeah. actually, actually, so the listening party we got coming up is going to be early May is live band. So I definitely, guys, definitely going to pull okay. up and send y'all okay, okay. live band. The listening party is that because I, 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 I just love the concept of unplugged and just being able to really just like Man, literally kind of, like, kind of be heard in, in that nature. To that would touch my soul right there. That's what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, for sure, yeah, for sure. Yeah, and, oh, and to so touch on another point, I said yep. so. It's, it, I don't want it to be too long but um there's probably so let's just say if it's like 18 songs there's probably five that are that which means they have third because i just feel like people like rp to, to the third verse like people do hook verse hook and then it's it it's, it's it you know what i'm saying so i intentionally made like five songs with like third verses just to give a vintage of what you just used to hear you just used to hear and i know it, it can be kind of drawn in the sense of that but i mean that's why i put it towards the middle so you would have understood more of my style at that okay. point and then you're gonna like okay I, I see where this is going because i just think people don't do third verses anymore it's just so quick like okay let me do for verse hook or sometimes you can have five hooks in one verse i just wanted to i'm, I'm more into the art of it so especially when you're doing a live band like you, you just yeah you just want to give them more so uh, that was the, that was one of those that's the concept on that for sure you know it's crazy i'm i'm mr anti long songs like that that that's me you know <laughs> i'm the guy you do i haven't said it in a while um but early on i was just like man the song's long song's long song's long you know what i'm saying um, and I guess my depth, my reasoning is because, you know, um, it's, it's, it, it takes like a product, like even big companies like Apple, Google, um, Nike, whatever, it takes people like seven times, uh, to seeing a product that they just newly released to make some type of decision, whether it be click the link, go to the website, actually purchase the product. So they spent a ton of fucking money to keep these products in our faces on our phones. We're probably gonna see a whole bunch of Wimbyama shit in a little bit because of his shit going on with Nike. But I mean, so with that being said, like we're constantly trying to cat, like artists are try constantly trying to like captivate an artist. I mean, their audience's attention, whether they're be being newly formed or mm -hmm. cultivated and curate. Because like people move on quickly, you know what I'm saying? And I think the reason why I was, I, I, especially if it's a current sound that an artist is doing, I'm like, mm -hmm. yo, you gotta make shorter song. It's not because I want to hear a shorter song; it's because the people want to hear a shorter song. Yeah, no, uh, and sure. that's not. It's almost like what Post Malone did. Like when he first came out, he was making like it was culturally appropriation to the to, to the max. We loved it. You know, he's making these songs, White Everson, all these other different rap songs and shit with Quavo and all this other shit like that. Mm -hmm. And then completely went like, a, 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 this new yeah, genre, yeah, new human, all, all that shit, cut his hair, blah, blah, blah. You know what I mean? So he was, he was able to do that and he, he didn't lose like his fan base because he had already cultivated them. Took the fuck off. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. that's just my take on it. Uh, take seven impressions to convert a customer. Yeah, man, it's crazy. And these companies out, oh, man, Listen, I used to like work at Facebook and I used to see, I, used, I don't know if it's, you can, people can still access it right now, but I would just on random days go on the back end and see how many, how much money companies are spending on ads. Good God. Oh yeah, that's shit. You, you know what I'm saying? That's what I said, it's like that other record, like it sounded similar to most stuff, but it depends on who's putting it behind you. Cause they put it up, you put it in your face. If enough, you put it up, yeah, 100%. You, you kind of start hearing it enough. You're like, you know what, maybe it's not so bad. Cause you start seeing and just seeing it so often and so much. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, definitely that. Like I said, definitely looking forward to to that that project. And like I said, just um, definitely, I mean, putting this lightning in the bottle. Like I said, live band and live shows, we definitely going to uh, do that. It'll be like the first week or second week in May. i got to get specific on the time because we're locking down the, the venue and things like that. But I mean, right. yeah, live band is just crazy and it just gives you a different feel. Yeah, that's that's why uh, you're familiar with uh, Mojo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that that's one of the reasons I absolutely love them because it's all live. And oh, even yeah. Mexican Step and um and um oh not Trey um damn brains farting tonight but anyway yeah you know what I'm talking about so, easily Easy. yeah ton of people ton yeah. of people here and Mojo I remember that is the name they used to use ring in the city you know Mojo yeah man oh yeah. <laughs> uh, man so I guess uh we look um we are hitting the free line so if you're still here man y'all make some noise in the chat. Gollum's about to get ready to throw that thing up on, uh, on yeah, the screen. Yeah, exactly. How did you um, know? <laughs> so, 
There it is. Uh, it, so make it. some noise. If you're an artist, you still in the chat, let us know. Send it. Uh, and I, I guess people wanted to, somebody wanted to know what our take was on the uh, the J. Cole thing. Um, you know, what, what, what is your th- your general thoughts about it all? I, I guess just maybe focusing on the apology outside of the boom. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> the whole thing is, it was top surface for me. Because like I said, then you listen to what the true definition of beef and things like that. If I, even when it's just verbally competitive, like, I mean, nah, I was a whole, I mean, Tupac by, by far. Right. Yeah. Fuck yeah. with the most, you know, di- legendary, disrespectful tracks ever. And so it's like, I really didn't gain anything from it because I just feel like it was all surface. Like even if you want to talk about Kendrick's part, for me, it means just as a lyricist and somebody who listens to music. Mm-hmm. Only thing he ever, he just said, you know, if you walk around with a stick, he ain't Andre 3K. I mean, that's not really a diss, you know? It's just, no, just, or fell off like The Simpsons. Yeah. A, so, a fucking show that's been around for yeah, 30 years. So I feel like uh, <laughs> Cole just really, like he even said, like he just kind of tried to pick some things to make a beat because like, like, I think you're dope. I think what you're doing on your show is dope. So then, yeah, yeah. all of a sudden, we have a disagreement. This is hyper, obviously, you know. So then, I, I can't then be like, your show's trash. Or you like, your music's trash. Like, if I believe you're good, you're good. So if two yeah. people believe that they're both completely dope, which I do believe they are, then how do you be? What do you, it, it's like the the thing that they put up. I think, I can't think that's ATL. And he's like, have a nice day. You have a fucking better yeah, day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, that you, movie, that you, movie, yeah. You, you go ahead. You, I wish your day is better. I wish your day is even He said, brother, better. you have a good day, brother. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, right, so yeah. I, that's what I got out of it. Like, yeah, I mean, for sure. Two guys who really, like, trying to figure out. There's no way to, to play that because beef really only works when one person really has a lame, you know, moment. Something you can kind of point out. I think Cole and... and Kendrick are so dope at a level that what would you say about each other? Like, so you both fuck with each other. So unless you're gonna tell us something that we don't know, now Drake they can play on because Drake's considered to be lover boy and oh you cry too much and oh you light skin behavior and things like that you can play on. So till he dropped that shoom 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 shoom. Remember that Meek Mill diss? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Back back to back. When he dropped that shit, people like oh. I think Drake is dope as fuck when he raps. So I mean, yeah, yeah. I mean, I, the apology part of it, I mean, could have could have gone without it. I mean, Shout out man. to Germany. Yeah. Um, listen, I'm gonna just say this, man. That's why I absolutely love being a civilian, man. I don't get, to, I don't have to worry about beef. <laughs> I can walk around. I can take my children to the park. I love it. Now, be a civilian. <laughs> like, like this was all posted. Like, <laughs> that, that's why I have no quorum about. The apology. I have no like, bro. I'm just like, fuck it, man. He, he, Cause I see Cole is this guy. Like, he probably like he's. I really feel like he had been sleeping good, and then when he did that, he couldn't sleep. I really feel that way when he said that on stage. I'm like, I believe him. Yeah. Like he, the way he was sounding, his deflections, his body language, he was troubled by what he did, man. Yeah. And even though he got dissed, but I just think Kendrick. It, Nothing would ever go to the streets with Kendrick. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, I don't. Like they're not like, not like. They are just nice at lyricism, and man. And if you go, like, say you go to Kendrick, like, what did he really like in Kendrick's on Metro song? What did he really say about Cole that's considered a diss? Like, right? I, I, yeah. I don't, I don't he was hear throwing. It. He, he it was more like Drake, but he was throwing him like little, like yeah, little pushes. Said, not even like you a. Know, if, if if he if he if you see him walking around with that stick, he ain't Andre D K. So you're saying like you want to be like yeah, it, it wasn't nothing that I really <laughs> heard that I was like, you know like like you said it was more the subliminals that Drake and playing off the name and bomb and I mean the biggest thing you probably got out of that is ain't no big three nigga it's the big me. Yeah. Other than that, bum. <laughs> yeah, I, I really didn't. It wasn't nothing that you was here and be like like wow like can't like you said J- that about me. J Cole still gonna be able to go do go Compton. Ain't nothing happening. Mm-hmm. J-, J. Cole's gonna be able to walk through the C- C- Compton if he wants. Nothing's gonna. Nobody gonna touch Cole and Compton. It, it, it'd be foolish, but like nobody's gonna be like pressing him like crazy. Oh, you fuck him. Yeah. Nobody's doing that in Compton with J. Cole. He's just, like J. Cole. I've seen J. Cole ride a bike in the street. Like you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, nobody. Now, I do feel like that project was dope, and I think that that beef label of it took away so those, those songs was, it was some dope songs on there like I, I haven't heard the project yet yeah. but people were saying that what that situation overshadowed it, it like did. it even bring the promotion that it did bro. that it, we wanted to but again like I'm from saying, number one comes on I can't remember who's on the first one because somebody else comes on rap first and they kind of going off and then Cole comes on second and he's bombing on that shit I was like 
God. Yeah. Gollum, what's your thoughts, Gollum? I'm old. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say is I'm old. Like, back in the day, everybody knew who the beef was between. Like, there wasn't no subliminal messages. Motherfuckers damn near calling out each other's names. You know, and it wasn't it's like it's all these different things. I I love the apology. I show I thought it showed growth. I thought it showed like like as I said like when you when I do something fucked up to somebody, I can't sleep with myself. Like I'm just like damn. Like I'm spending at night. I'm like why did I do that? Why am I that type of guy? Like you know what I'm saying? And so that's what I think. I think Kendrick was just. I'm, I'm sorry, J Cole was just kind of like damn man. Like why did I really do that? Why did I really do that? Um, and I think for everybody that wants the beef, I, I don't know why you want that, especially, and this is like I said, I'm old, especially when dudes are dying behind shit, talking shit, you ain't gonna do nothing to me, I got all this gold, I got this, and next thing you know, somebody's dead because these guys wanted to make a name for themselves because these rappers were beefing with each other or beefing with a clique or beefing with a set or whatever else and i just i think it's i think it's old i know it's street i know and rap see, is a thing, language though, it's I, not even street because it's like you talk about we're not talking about like 50 and somebody no, 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 we're no. talking about like exactly. cole and kendrick it, it, neither it, one of them wear a lot of jewelry <laughs> neither one of them riding fancy cars exactly. slave money we know i know they're both millionaires like neither one of them i dress better than cole yeah like neither one of them and he walk got around bread. with this you know <laughs> typical rap so, so it's like when you see these two guys it's like a conversation more than anything yeah like, exactly yeah. what up midnight yeah. mops yeah man so i that, love that name midnight mops they, just, don't even, they don't even talk aggressively like no. it's just Yo, like no, no. yeah so because uh, people in hip-hop and the rap like we're so they we, they want a body so bad they want blood so bad but i'm i'm tired of that you know what i'm saying like if it's i like competition but nobody's Nobody, no, no, yeah. in the streets. We don't want none of that. You know I what I'm saying? That's by far. Now, now, according to people. sources like academics and Button, they, they apparently Drake and Kendra got nuclear disses that's about to drop. Like we, I, I, I still don't think it's going to be. Any, Drake is still going to be able to go to L.A. There's oh, not, yeah. there's nothing. But apparently, there's going to be some nuclear level disses yes. drop. I mean, I want to hear it, but you know, I mean, if they don't drop it, I don't care. You I know. I think Pusha had the best attempt at Drake and like gave us some stuff we didn't know and oh, yeah. insulting and everything Ooh, and as good of a shot as he took yeah, yeah. like Drake still you know released a dope out and still and now it's like not even really kind of talked about so best best concert I've ever been to now I've seen Jay and Ye together on stage but excuse me I'm gonna say best like that Drake concert I went to top top fucking yeah. five bro yeah. They spent a lot of fucking money, bro. It was fucking impeccable. Yeah. Like it was, in, it was unreal. It's intentional. It's yeah. everything. It's like when Jay Z or Beyonce, when they do something, it's very specific. It's very everything. It seems like a lot is going on those Drake shows, but from the lighting to the, the songs, everything's picked down to the and it's so it's so immaculately put on that it's it's crazy. I got backstage footage of that and like you when you see the limer, number of computers, the <laughs> number of technicians, <laughs> the number of pyro controllers, yeah. the number of like it's like for each station it's like twenty people. And man. They don't fuck around all over the yeah, place too. Yeah, redundancy like if something go down up oh, we're okay we got this in place already that's gonna take care of it. it everything is perfect. Security was on point like and it you was. See, you could tell his next level when, the, and I know he's not the first to do it, but when they do those, because like typically somebody's just on a stage crowd in front of you, like they do these circle stages where they can Love. just play to the whole crowd. You ain't Crazy. just yeah. back you can see people like yo, you with the sign right way. there. Yeah, come down here, walk around back. Let's turn around. Let's go this way now. Like it's it's like a basketball game, and you can just look around the whole way. Exactly. Like just hey, everybody see what you're doing. looking at this front yeah. view of something. Yeah. So it's it's crazy. One of the things at WWE, they had a rock entrance, and they said the final rock entrance i don't know what, if it was or not but they had all the screens and like the lightning it was so deliberate how the lightning was striking on the screen mm -hmm. and then it was like one bolt struck in the middle mm -hmm. and then right when that bolt struck in the middle the lighting came up right on the rock so it's like the lighting like either it's landed crazy. the rock or yeah. struck <laughs> the rock and that's you know even when we went to um pfl to the fights <laughs> I just like my mind is blown oh, yeah. about like when you see it, like what can be replicated. But then the flip side of that is like when you see it, who came up with that shit? Because it's, sometimes it's so original. You're just mm -hmm. like, damn. Like, and there's somebody sitting on the on a computer 
you know, saying, hey, we need this, this, and this, and somebody else is developing on the back end and dropping it, so. <laughs> it reminds me of the Super Bowl, because, uh, like, how much goes into the Super Bowl, like, it's perfect. Like, it, it, now, whether you love it or not, depends on the artist, but it reminds me of a Super Bowl production, like, everything goes into it. Right, right. And they do that right. every night in every city and every, you know, like, that's crazy. That's crazy. Well, they talk about how much Taylor Swift, didn't she give, like, everybody on her tour, like, a $100,000 yeah, bonus should. or some shit like that? You talking about the workers? Yeah, the or, workers or the uh, truckers. I think the drivers. Because then you, nobody talks about, like, you got multiple stages being set up in multiple Lord cities yeah, take that down at different times. I know, well, no, but but you got, like, you're in Houston, and then your next night you're in Dallas, yeah. and then somebody's already setting up the stage for Dallas. While the Houston, it's, it's Logistics, man. Yeah. Logistics. Yep. Yep, and I love it. Uh, man, so great conversation, guys. Um, listen, like, if you're an artist, like... Some people that came over from TikTok, we may not be able to get your songs in, but we gonna, you know, I think we if we do like a couple of seconds of the song, we'll get through it. So if you're an artist, come to YouTube right now and check in, like right now, because we're gonna be doing a minute plays for the free line right now. All right. Um, so in fact, TikTok, I'm about to leave right now. So if if you in here and you don't see me no more, that wow. means you gotta come to YouTube, yo. Cause uh, YouTube yeah, we've been right clocked now. in for a while. So y'all come to YouTube right now. Link in the bio or just search the San Pluto Show on TikTok, man. Y'all, I gotta go, y'all. Shit, man, they gonna they never gonna stop <laughs> on Damn. TikTok. You want? They, I don't know what happened on TikTok, but we just got like five songs submitted, six songs. I know, I know, minutes. I know, I know. We probably not gonna, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, we can do. You want to do a roll call now? Yeah, let's do roll call right now. Let's do roll call right now for All the free right. block. Uh, uh, look, look, everybody come up for TikTok. Shout out to people that's following instructions, man. Yeah, if you came over here, and especially if you're a woman, you came over here, stay on. We gonna make sure we get you. Yeah, playing. man. We gonna make sure you, um, and women are not played enough. On these shows, for sure, for sure. So let's let's do a little John. Hey, th- hey look at that! Thanks yeah, for subscribing. Been too. Thanks for subscribing. Um, if you if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so because we have a ton of fun on the show. Um, we about to do our little roll call. I'm gonna let Garland take it away, man. Um, All right, I'll start with Trino, Trino, Trino. What? What? It's how you know we at the end of the show when you hear this song right here. So you better you know let Garland know you're here. Listen, Listen, we've been tapped in for how many hours now? Let's wow. See, see. And, and, you know, Flu been here, man. Flu yeah, didn't have to stay this long, but he did, man. So show some love for Flu, man. We Y'all go follow Flu on his social media platform. We're right going now. on three hours right now. Probably going to hit four hours before it's all said and done. Coming up soon, we'll probably have one of them long-ass five, six-hour shows. Uh, <laughs> yeah. But not tonight. Not yeah. tonight. Y'all still want to do, like, a 24-hour stream, man. Yo, crazy. Man, I think we can do it. Hey, Woo! I think we can, we, yo, we can, we can do a, we can do a live set with Trino in the other room, have them play for an hour. You know what I'm saying? Like, it man, can be man, done. man, man, yeah, we, yeah, yeah, let's it can be done. Like, yeah, you just, just go. We'll figure it <laughs> out. All right. A bunch of stuff in. And but, bunch of shit. <laughs> All right, so this is what we call the roll call. You ain't got to be here, but you got to be here if you want your music played. So we're starting off with Trino. Trino, I know you were here early. I don't know if you're here now. Skite, I see you, baby. Two white, um, black dog, the freaky B. Shit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Spelled with ones and threes oh, yeah, so and like saying, the B's and crazy. shit. And I'm like, um, hooked on phonics works for me. Um, just Dylan, Keith Love, MBS Mala, Mala, um, Kid Quee, uh, VV Ren, Max Zero, um, Rady Stars. Let's see, 601, somebody, 601, money. let's see, and then what we got, Darius. So there's somebody that said, I'm, they love. Yeah, I got, I got you, they love, I got you, they love, you guys stay on though. Um, Slime Rage, Syntax. Oh, the subscribers ah, jump like a motherfucker. Syntax, all right. Um, so Mia, and then KP, if y'all are here, tap in. Okay, VV Ren still here. So okay, Snow so Kid Quay. We got no MBS. I see you, Darius. Darius. No <laughs> Keith Low. Yeah. yeah no go. just Dylan. Uh actually leave just Dylan. You want just okay, I yeah. thought so. I didn't say his name. <laughs> Black Dog the freaky one. I said, I'm kinda curious about that shit. Yeah, he man. always sent music in and he, he, he may or may not. <laughs> so how do you say, how do you say his name right here? So 
Somnia. Somnia. Is it so, Somnia? Somnia. Oh, yeah, I think Somnia. Somnia. Like, Somnia. I got you, boo. We see you. I, I'm saying boo. They, you, she, I don't know shit. I got you, lady. Look. I got you. Fuck. I'm just fucking up right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So um, let's start with, are we going to do a one minute place? Yeah, we do a one minute place. Let All me right, cut cool. this off. All right. So let's get it. Um... All right, it looks like y'all survived. Like insomnia, but without somnia, the somnia, somnia. There you go. Somnia. I bet. I um, like that. Damn, like the insomnia this. without the N. Wait, did, who's this KP right here? Is that, is that KP, KP? Uh, oh, we'll see. Um, he said, damn, I've been on YouTube five years now, and y'all have more than that. <laughs> we try, man. If you haven't subscribed, hey, do that right now. Right now, if, if what I would want everybody to do. This is the first time we've ever asked somebody to do this. What's up? Take a second. Yeah. Subscribe to Make Zero. Ooh. Subscribe to his Let me page. Do it right now. I'll do it right now. Hold he on. Got, wait, you got 170. Let's see if we can get up to 180 tonight. Let's see if we can get 10 subscribers to Make Zero. Get I'm it. going to. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm already subscribed. You Look subscribe. at that. Hey, hey, hey. I'm one of your subscribers. Matter of yeah. fact, hold on. And I'll, I'll do it in a second because I don't want to kick anything off. Oh, I can do it on my phone. Hold up. Because you got all them emails. Um, so who are we playing first? Uh, is, it, is it him or? Uh, we are playing first. First to the stage is Skype, 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 Skype. Oh, yeah. Skype, Hell Skype. yeah. Skype here. 840. All right. Woo. All right. Here couple we go. In. I got to go to the studio. So I want to hear a couple more, though. Okay. Okay. Uh, we got Indie Pop. Uh, so this is indie pop, all right? Skype. Um, this is from Skype right here from the start remix. So he's saying this genre is indie pop. We go on to SoundCloud, so y'all just bear with me. Everybody that came through. Employers are on the lookout for. That's the commercial. Everybody that came through from TikTok, we really appreciate you. If you haven't tuned into the show before, I'm glad you came over here because it looks a little bit. It looks a little bit dope, right? It looks looks dope over here. Look, look at the. Hold up. You know what I'm saying? Do your thing. Wait, wait, let, let me sit up straight because I know I'm chopped Bam, off a little bit. Look at that. Look Woo! at that camera. Oh, that's crispy, boy. Look how crispy that shit is. Damn. Hold up. Then we got this dude. Yeah. Side. Oh, Amazon and Amazon. Yeah, yeah, I like that shit. Right <laughs> the button. I ain't gonna do like six the just with Amazon just all on this up, shit. You know what I'm saying? And then, of course, we got the three of. I like that. Sound. That shit buttery. There we go, Sam. Clarity. There we go, Amazon buttery. again right there. I swear I ain't that old. It's just my kids gave me these hairs. You know there we go. I'm in Istanbul right now. Yeah, I'm in Galilee. Istanbul. He ain't even with us. He in another country, Listen, another what, dimension. What, what, what I got on this? What I got on this? What you got on that movie right there? There we go. There we go. Side by side. Shout out for now. Yeah. If you're doing something, do it right. Man. Yeah, we're about to go yeah, wild definitely, here. Definitely. I don't even know what this one's gonna look like. Oh, shit. Shit. What's this one gonna look like? Oh, damn. Shit. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Damn, that's that'd it. be kind of crazy. I ain't mad at it. Oh. We know we never we use these. I know that's that that's that MSNBC right here, boy. Yeah, man. If you gonna oh, do okay. right that Hey shit man, hard. we gotta look into this shit, man. You already know, man. All we gotta do is get a bunch of laptops. A bunch of laptops, a <laughs> bunch of Chromebooks and yeah, shit. Yeah, a bunch of Chromebooks, bring people in on chat. Absolutely. We can do it, man. So absolutely oh, the song is playing. Um so look. Oh shit. Uh we this is Skype right here from the start remix. Um, let me, let me <laughs> How much money you be spending on this equipment, man? And like, like y'all be spending money on anyway. You don't even want to know. <laughs> you don't even want to yeah, know. Yeah, for sure. Here we go. Let's get the Skype record going. Here we go. So we're going to be doing a minute plays real quick. Let's see what Skype got, man. Don't you notice how? He sound mad different. I don't need reminders on how you don't feel the same. Oh, the burning pain. Listening to you talk about some new so big. He's so perfect, blah, blah, blah. Oh, how I wish you'd wake up one day. Run to me, confess your love. At least just give me say that way. I might have to do go up, man. Woo! Shit. Listen, man. That was some great production. The first thing that came to my mind, black anime. Mm. Specifically. You know what I'm saying? Like a scene. 
uh, where at the beginning he's they're like running or they, they it's like a little scene that introducing all the characters and shit. This song right here, you know what I mean? Um, you know, I, when I was younger, I used to watch a ton of fucking anime. Not now, not as much. I tap into new shit here and there, you know what I mean? But like, I, I definitely could see this in like uh, an independent studio um, anime for sure. Like, um, you know, he's he, he sent us a wide variety of t uh, different types of music. I've never seen him with this level of uh, pitch correction on the vocals, huh? How old is he? Mm, you know, I'm sure it's great. You know what I'm saying? Let us on the chat. Uh, thanks for subscribing to the uh, uh, channel as well. Thanks for subscribing. The subscribers are going crazy. I tell y'all friends and stuff to come through, man. We go shout, uh, we go live weekly. But like this record, God damn, we got to do your thing. Do your thing. Do your thing. <laughs> um, thanks for the love. Get definitely, plugs. definitely enjoyed uh, this record. Um, I love this indie pop vibe, man. Especially, I, I just love it. So, uh, overall, dope take, dope track. Um, I'm definitely giving it like a solid 4.2 out of five. Uh, God, this man, see, he's 17. 17. This man, Sky is ahead. Yes, this thing, and this record got 28,000 players on SoundCloud. You yes, know what I'm saying? Man. Uh, and all his records got th thousands of plays. Like every record he's ever sent me got thousands of you know plays on this particular platform. Um, but yeah, man, overall dope track, man. I'm, I'm I wonder if he's uh, anime inspired as well, or the things, the type of things he consumes that he was inspired by this record right here. So overall, it's a 4.2 for me because um, I did like the vocal mix. But if I'm like really nitpicking. They weren't as polished as I want them to be, but I think he also self-engineers a ton of his stuff, but it's at a good spot right now. Um, just going back and figuring out how to marry everything together and blend a little bit better. Um, in my opinion, it's, it's a good song. So 4.2 for me, for sure. Vibes. I thought it was solid as fuck. Can I say that? Oh, um, yeah, solid yeah. as heck. No, uh, yeah, no, has, no, no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, solid as fuck. Production was great, and only being 17, by far ahead of the curve. Yes. Uh, man, I, I ain't gonna lie. I think it's my first five of the night. I, I, I really. Woo! For the, hey, hold on. He cooking for the genre that you know is a different genre. Like I could see, like overseas, like that's like that could be a huge record. Like is this, this is, is this there? It's going to production, the pauses, the. the Stop and keep going. Like it was a dope record, especially for that genre. I, th I mean, I think it was dope. So I'm gonna look up that person right now, right? Yeah, uh, Sky, uh, Golan, go ahead. What's your thoughts on that? Very nice. Um, enjoyed it. Uh, Sky's been sending him music. You can see the growth from um, song to song. I think oh. now we're 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 about a six to eight months in on Skype. Some of these people were a year in on, and we can see the growth, right? Um, so I'm uh, I'm. What did y'all give it? I was at a 4.2. Five. First five, five of the night. Oh, Shout damn. Out to okay. I, I thought it was dope. Shout okay. Out to Very the five. nice. Yeah. I'm, I'm sitting at uh, 4.4. 4. 4. 4. 4. 4. 4. 4. 4.4 on that one. Yeah. Oh, Lord. We actually may get hit for this record because he. this was an actual remix. Yeah, he said remix. Oh, so well, we from get this, hit for shit all the time. And this, the, so. the actual artist, she has 1.3 million subscribers <laughs> oh. on. Hey, YouTube not going to like that. But we liked it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, <laughs> okay. yeah so, so, so it sounded like something that was just yeah. big, like already. Yeah, so, that's crazy. Man, that was that was a good shout out to Skype. My bad, Galen. Um, what was your take again? Uh, four point four. I enjoyed it. Right. I, I see. I see the growth. Right, man. Seventeen years old. Uh, just 17. Dylan's a little. Just Dylan's a little young too. Right? No. He's, he's in his 20s. He's in his 20s. Early. What's the other cat? Um, it was the, the Soul Power. They were like 19. Yeah, they were 19. Mama. Which Mama's son? Um, uh, he, he, uh, he's 13. So we have this, this mom that submits music to all these music review channels for her son. And her son can spit, dude. He's yeah. like, he's probably like 14 now. Mm -hmm. But like, I'm, he's, it, it's, it's, it's insane, man. Like, Straight actually, bars. his name so. is Krill Insane. Yeah. yeah. Uh, That's hard. And then look, Meg Zero, uh, uh, well, VVS Ren, he's a producer, super young producer. Man, man dope, so man. shout out to the young talent. Y'all keep flourishing, By keep far. cooking, keep practicing, man. Like that's so the only thing I can really say. Into that's just dope, and and if I could figure a lot of this stuff out at 15, 14, like man, right. the fact that y'all y'all by far ahead of the game. So man, keep getting better, keep pushing it. Like it's great, it's dope. The the, the technology is just leaps and bounds ahead. Because we did have FL Studio in in our teens, like the first FL. But now yeah, it's yeah. fucking by far. Like you press one button, the beat is made and shit. Like yeah, you know, it's done. so it's kind of crazy. You can sit um, in your room, 
get an idea, record it, yeah. put it out to the world in the next, in 24 hours. Like that's crazy. Yeah, he no, said I forgot. I was hey, Scott, you don't worry about. It. We get hit all as long as we don't get hit. They're like jabs. The it's not like yeah. a hit strike, but it's like a jab. For it's sure. annoying. It's yeah. annoying as fuck. They they make us meet y'all music actually. You know, so which is fine. Um, but Colin, who he got next? Uh, um, VV Ren say he's 16. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, damn. Is Yo, he next? Thanks. Uh, no, uh, just Dylan's next. Eight forty-seven. Just, uh, just Dylan. Okay. Yeah. Yo, and, and thank y'all for fucking with us, old motherfuckers too. <laughs> yeah, the, the youngsters, you know what I'm saying? Because they talk about you know boomers and the X generation and shit like that. And we got we got a young crowd in here. And thanks yeah. thanks for the love. Thanks for the respect. I, I'm, 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 I'm just keeping it real, man. Well, Shout man. out to the millennials. You know what I'm <laughs> What's up, gang? Where y'all yeah, at? I'm millennials check in. Shout out to the whole. Vibe, like I said, San Pluto show. Like, yeah, I mean, give an opportunity you, to man. somebody. Like, thank you, you're 16, thank you. being able to get your music heard and get that. And it, it ain't like tailored to, you know, an older crowd or what you like. You know what I mean? Yeah, that, yeah. that was a completely different sound and a couple of Absolutely. different sounds. So, I mean, that's dope. Absolutely. How many, how many more songs you got? Yeah. I can do two more. We got two more songs from Flu, so make them good. So, we got Just Dylan. Uh, you know, it's crazy. I used to manage, not manage, I used to uh, consult. Just Dylan. Uh -huh. You know, we've done multiple projects together at our studio before it burned down. We had a studio in the city by the airport, burned down, RP studio. Um, but we he recorded a ton of his music. Now he's doing his, he's self engineering his own shit. Uh -huh. He sounds good. Uh, and I, I'm really hoping he makes this crazy comeback, man, because he's, he's, he's young and he's uh, he self engineering it. all of his shit. So I haven't heard this record. I purposely don't listen to his music. Cause I used to listen to so much of it, unless he sends it to me in the show. You know what I'm saying? So he's uh, he came back, sent me something called Judge Judy. Um, he's from the city of San Antonio. He's dropping three new songs. Uh, project title uh, is Melodic. Uh, no. Oh, the pro that's the title. Title Love. Oh, Love is Melodic. That's the name of the project. Mm -hmm. um, and say San Pluto going crazy, mad love. Yeah, ah, shout out to the game, man. All right, so let's go. Um, let's see, man. This record is called Just Judy. Let's go. By Just Dylan. Yeah, yeah. Jay, motherfucker. Go a little something like this. I said you must be a jug. I'm addicted to your love. I just care about who you are. I don't care about who you was. My name is not Judy, baby. I am not no judge. And my only duty is to love. It's Cinderella, and what you do with Stella, girl, I'm just trying to tell you, these is not lies I sell you, I keep it true, that's all I do, you super fly with it, no parachute, girl, they don't compare to you, ready, said one girl, I'm player, but look, this love ain't no game, somebody playing with you, then he get punched in the face, and I keep that hush on my waist, if I gotta shut down this place, I said, you must be a jug, I'm addicted to your love, I just care about who you are, I don't care about who you was, yeah. my name is not Judy, baby. I am not a judge, and my only duty is to love, is to love on you. On you. Yeah, I fucked around and played the whole song, my bad. On you. Drug, I'm addicted to your love. I just care about who you are, I don't care about who you was. Yeah. My name is not Judy, baby, I am not no judge. Mm. And my only duty is to love, is to love on you. too much yeah I, it's yeah and then the, i don't is the bass is really heavy man i want oh, bass is knocking. the bass is knocking like and that could have been but the bass is knocking period though. period so i'm like that i'm still i'm still training with these uh these headphones yeah, i know that, 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 that bass was way way heavy i loved it okay I actually that's love that shit. I, that's a 4.8 for me. Yeah, I like. I okay, like the, okay. Y'all do your thing. Do your thing. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, I like the bass. I mean, I like heavy music. Uh, I thought the the recording could have been a little more clear, but it's yeah. definitely catchy. It sounds like one of those just quirky little just kind of songs that just works. Like right. his, little, his little little concept and the whole Judge Judy and played off of it and the, <laughs> and the pitch change in in, in the rapping and yeah. stuff. So I thought it was pretty solid. Uh, I can go. I can go like three point eight. I thought it was. I thought it was very something you can hear that that you will become catchy for sure. Damn man, I'm I'm actually may have to take these headphones back, Galen. <laughs> Cause I I'm still trying to like 
like my old headphones i i listened to several sessions and i was those were like now i don't know if my volume was right is it too crispy is it too honest like these they're so honest but it, it's too honest with a bass richness in it because yeah, what i heard on this one is i heard the vocals recorded cleanly very nice but so. they were not mixed with the beat and I, uh, and maybe this was uh the first mix um what i did like a, a lot uh, more was i like the beat i like the the length of the song it was only a minute and 35 seconds i know that's extremely short but i 100 got the just of everything that he was trying to get across mm -hmm. from a lyrical standpoint within a minute and 35 seconds there's no there's nothing more he should have said you know what i'm saying um but what i'm saying is uh like the vocals again they sounded clear but what i was hearing is dipped like i didn't hear it cutting through the mix at all and that could have been because the bass uh the bass was fire which is which is a truthful matter of the headphones yeah. what it's telling me it, it was thumping but uh, a conflict happened with the vocal mix getting through. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, I don't know. Why don't so. you just get the same headphones that you had before? Fuck, man. I don't know. Because I like this brand, but this is their newest brand. This is the, They just came man, out with definitely these. definitely clear as hell. Yeah. It's, it's that very direct I'm, 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 I'm going to let you well, listen he, to the yeah, next he song. He needs to listen to those because he likes these that he's listened to, but these are really yeah, bass heavy. Are yeah, these are, oh, yeah, these are different, crazy different. Bro. Yeah, it's oh, big yeah. time different. So yeah, let me hear yeah, the next song. I'm gonna let you listen to the. These are like crispy, like it's on yeah. point, but in a good way though. It's crispy yeah. on point. I could, yeah, I could tell that yours almost have an echo almost. It's crazy, like it, 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 it it's literally crazy a little bit. So yeah. I might send these back actually. So they, 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 do, they um, too honest. Let's do VV ran at nine thirteen, and y'all can okay. listen to that. Do it yourself. Do it yourself. Shout out to Judge Dillon. Do it all by yourself. Yeah, I can have, uh, difference already. It's crazy. Um, so check check out this beat right here. Uh, so this this is. Okay, true. hold on, hold on. He's saying my track called "Watch Watch Your Back." Okay, so he wants to uh, watch your back at nine thirty eight. Got you. So this is um uh. I'm calling them VBS Ren now because that's the name. Yeah, the VBS Ren, yeah. Open back headphones. Get the K, hey, AKG K240s, uh, Sade. A AKG K240s. That's what I should have just got. Like, you know, I was being Hey, stupid. VBS, where are you from, man? Um. All right, let me cut this up. So we got to be here. Uh, watch your back. So this is a beat, I believe. He just uploaded this two hours ago right now. Um, here we go. Let's see. Yeah, I'm, it's just like one of them things I'm have to learn like how to listen to these headphones because it's just it's the clarity piece it's, it's so crispy yeah. which is like it's telling me like if it's too high those are I like the response in these I do like the response in these these are just kind of like it's, it's allowing me to hear every all the mistakes and it's kind of like too much sometimes mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying um but 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 overall this was just a beat um so it's a standard beat the beat was tough, I agree. Um, this, this guy actually DM me. He's like, yo, every time I try to submit your music, the show is almost always ending. This guy, <laughs> he DM me one day. I think that's the dude. But um, overall, again, dope beat. Um, okay, chops of the samples. 
like you know in the scratching you know what i mean had like a little you know syncopation if you will for lack of better words um like you know off with the beat and you know chops yeah, and stuff like that but um overall dope beat um it was, yeah it was it was tough man i don't I have too much to say about it but shout out to uh uh that sample i really love it and the cover art is dope too i love the cover art so shout out to um bbs ren in the chat as well you hear that train i think it's a train right you hear that yeah but i never hear the horn yeah. me neither because they can't honk the horn in certain areas oh wow so somebody somebody probably was bullshit in the distance kinda, it's kind of crazy because you know how this yeah, street is one way you know how the i'm oh, sorry my, my. you yeah. know how this street is one way yeah it's actually like a law that was passed and that's why streets are one way because if it's two ways and they got to put down both things and honk the horn mm -hmm. so and because it's a, oh. a residential district and some shit like that they intentionally did some things because they wanted to open up some of these um, places over here i had i was reading all about Damn, it because i was okay, like hey that's really fucking specific no it is, it, it <laughs> you is. Know it is. that's why i heard the shit. horn i'm like damn why am i hearing this horn because normally we don't hear it Oh, we got wow. a train that run out there in, in Istanbul. That we, we got a train in Istanbul. Yeah, we do. Oh yeah, yeah we do. Um, but yeah, man, uh, just regularly, uh, it was it was a dope beat, man. I would love to hear like an artist on that. An artist, maybe even like flu rap on that. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, just to see what what it comes about. You know what I mean? So yeah. overall, dope beat. Uh, shout out to him. I'm definitely like at a solid. Um, I'm at like a solid three seven, three seven. You know what I'm saying? Standard. It sounded like it didn't have any type of dynamics. It was going to be like one of the uh, kind of redundant one. You know what I mean? Um, oh, yeah. Hey, uh, check out Flu DJ Links on his Instagram. DM. DM. That's his Instagram right there. But what do y'all think about that beat from BBS Ren real quick? Yeah, definitely. Uh, I like to hear. I would like to hear more from you. Uh, I mean, should definitely send me some. Um, I liked it. Uh, I agree with the, the, the scratch. I, I don't know if that was intentional, but it was a little off for me. Right. Uh, so I could have done without that. I thought the sample came in clean, and when the beat was very clean and basic, and the cover work is fire. I love black yeah. vintage art types of things. Like, I like that. It reminded um, me of the Great Migration. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? With people hard. moving from the south to the north. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, so. I, I love the beat. Uh, like I said, I could have done without the scratching part because it just felt like it was out of place. But the beat and the sample and everything came in hard, real basic, real easy to rap on, tell a story, talk, you know, about something specific on, uh, remind me of Nas, like I could hear like Nas, I mean, reminded me of that type of mm. vibe on it. So uh, I would go like, I would go as high as, uh, I'll give you like a four. I think the, the scratching thing could have been taken off right. or just placed a little more clean, like time, like, you know, just the and then it's left that alone without the scratching. But got you. Uh, but I thought it was dope, though. Yeah, that 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 would be that would be uh, King's King's. Was it was it was it Nas's series King's now? King's or King's that, that King's like, Disease yeah. Three or some shit like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Garland. Um, I enjoyed it. Uh, you know, we, you remember he's from New Zealand. Okay, really? see, I forgot. I forgot. Yeah, he's I forgot. from New Zealand. So Some great artwork um, and great what time production is in with that. New Zealand that's shit. Crazy. I don't even know. Yeah, that's crazy. Um, tapped in from that far away. I like. A, I love the artwork. It, 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 it's be crazy. It's, like where it's people are sometimes. Yeah, that's shit. crazy. Wow. It's something in the afternoon there. It's, I, I want to say maybe two, three, four in the afternoon. Maybe a little bit later. I'm not too sure though. I'm not 100 percent sure. Um, but I enjoyed it. I, I really, I actually did like it. I'm at a, for the beat, I'm at a solid four. Solid four? Yeah, solid shout four. Shout out to him, man. Listen, man, so um, uh, big shout out to Flu, man. He he didn't have to be here for this long, man, but he did, man. So we really appreciate your time. Thanks for coming through. All uh, Best of luck with the project coming out in the... Um, the release party or uh, that you're doing for the project coming up soon with the band. Hopefully that's planned and like, that venue is locked in and able to yeah, kind of get done. Yeah, no, venue is locked in. I said we just trying to get the particulars. I mean, because again, I'm nowhere Drake's budget, but like you said, I want to get it done right. So I have lights, sound, camp. You know, I got everybody coming in to make sure they can get everything, the best product out. So that's the only thing we're doing is locking in the particulars of right. what we want to do and how and stage and what can we do with that. So it's going to happen first week or two of, of May and then the project will drop May 17th. So definitely, man, uh, man, at Flu Season 83 on everything. I appreciate y'all yeah, submitting Flu everything. Nice. Man, never heard, never been to a review or done thing where I just didn't hear something out at one point where I was like, damn, that's, I ain't like that. Right, so right. everything y'all submitted, was you know fuck wittable you know, it wasn't nothing fuck that, wittable. that yeah. i just was like nah yes. that ain't it like it's yeah. the beats like I said 
this, and then the, the age range, some of y'all 16, 17, 19, like that's crazy. So New York. Shout out to y'all. That's fire. Yeah. Shout out to the show, the production. This is Thank probably you. the most well ran production that I've done on the Appreciate Riddle you, show. Man. Thank you, man. man Thank you so much. That means a lot on here. It has nothing to do with knowing you. It has nothing to do y'all with heard it. any of that. Like the production, the, the pop is the sound. Yeah. I mean, the everything. Like it's it's there, man. The background, it, it's real. It's real authentic and it's real like you can tell to see the growth in it. I I never seen y'all before, but I mean where you're at now, like I said, it's, it's definitely you can see. Right. Like the, the I I would love to be here again. Like it's dope. It's dope. So it's, it's crazy because it's like little it's things. Like the table was turned and we were shooting another way. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then it wasn't enough. It, I don't even I couldn't even tell you why it wasn't depth. And yeah. then we moved the table and like this weird depth comes in. Yeah. Yeah. You know? it's totally and like the, and that light at the total. back. We I know that the, light. Yeah. The light. We added the light in the back. Neon light and even just some so sort of ghost thing. Like, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You can never tell. Shout out you, to like, Joanne. You would think we was on a green screen or something. Like this is a nah, real facts. background. Yeah, like, yeah, it's a real. Like, yeah, that's like, true. Like, Damn, like, you look at it. Green screen and, <laughs> and like we moving. And it's like, like yeah, that's it's, a real. The background's not moving, but we this is a real. Yeah, yeah, we like, like, that's the damn camera we got. Trust me. Yeah, that's crispy. That's fire. So so make sure y'all um follow uh flu. Um, I posted his Instagram in the chat as well and tap in with his project. Make sure to stream and buy it you know what i'm saying uh when it comes out man we really uh yeah, it's gonna be on all really platforms all Yo. media platforms gonna be on apple spotify everything and make sure y'all continue to support shows like this because this is where you get that honest feedback you know it's yeah. not a show where people just come on to hate oh that's trash that's trash because it ain't you and like people are giving you honest feedback honest ears right. honest sound i'm telling you right now the production the sound the clarity we can hear everything y'all submitted so it's an honest that's amzai like amzai like he ain't fucking around like, with sound yeah man yeah. so this is definitely one of those shows that you want to get your music into and be heard and Butter put it me. up there man that's dope so shout out to my look sister forward to seeing y'all continue to grow yes love it and appreciate it thank you man Yo, we have got say he's gonna send you some you. um send you some oh, beats definitely dog. send me some i love that last beat you sent man like I said, uh, I would love to hear more from you. And the fact you're in New Zealand, tapping that's in crazy. that crate, that's crazy. So shout out to you and keep doing that, man. I, I would love to work on something you got, man. Y'all make some noise for uh, Flu, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, y'all, be y'all safe y'all be out easy. there. Be safe out there. Y'all walk him out. Uh, Pablo the Thank One you, with Wobble at 1015. Yeah, man. Um, so listen, guys. Uh, you know, hey, Shade says she tired. Shade, look, man. Shade, shot, shot, y'all make some noise. For the community chief shot A, man. Goodness, man. Holding it down. Um, uh, always shows massive love. Uh, being here. That, that, that means so much that uh, she hangs out with us when we go live, man. It really does. Or when everybody hangs out with us. But um, we love that. So, you know, something that we're trying to do, guys, in the future, before I get to this next song uh, from Pablo the One, um, we really trying to... Um, we really trying to just so it's it's a show right so we're not really not a, like it's a music based show so i want to do a game night that's music inspired with your music right but we're playing uh engaging games right um together uh while we listen to the music man i want to try that out so it's, we always trying to do something different we've done live comedy shows live performances here with music we've done live at remote shows which we got one coming up at the end of the month at a studio in the city um that's going to be fun so we're trying to really do something different so if you want to be a part of that game night man i i pinned the comment in the youtube chat right now um so when we get a, a good amount of people um i'll begin to throw some dates out there for everybody so man we just like to do this different shit you know what i'm saying that's i mean that's really it you know honestly and make sure to join the discord man because I'm, I'm really trying to get the discord to go absolutely crazy because eventually I want to invite people on digitally. Like, so say if we got somebody in Dublin, in London or something like that, or in New Zealand, like we can invite them on via um, Discord. You know what I'm saying? So if you haven't joined the Discord, make sure to hit that link as well, uh, next as well. Um, so I did. So, yeah, yeah, we got you. So it's, it's a couple of people in here, links that we got to get to. Um, like Pablo the One and and uh we we definitely should get you in uh tonight anybody that's left in the chat as well uh me and pablo uh for the ogs you know what i'm saying got you okay so pablo we got pablo this is he said older beat but mixed better that's what he said um hell yeah hell yeah um 
so let's get to this we're going to dropbox i like how everything is just in dropbox now bro so did you how did you did, did, did you put all your files somewhere and then it all you had it all convert to dropbox or something like that how did you do this you know what i'm saying or did you just after you exported it or does fl have like an export to dropbox feature you know what i'm saying anyway uh this is wobble remixed all right here we go Okay. With them horns. New York's still here. Pablo, you know, I'm glad you went back so and you and you remixed that because I definitely heard something. You know what I'm saying? Uh they love my man. Whoever they love is is I love the persistence. And we we you know, uh if your music is an email, we're definitely probably gonna get to it before we go out tonight. But look, that was Pablo with the his record called Wobble, and he remixed it. Um, you know what's crazy? Outside the horns weren't my favorite thing, honestly. Um, because I know again producers kind of hate this this word and i know pablo hates it too but they kind of sound stock and he probably's gonna say they weren't stock <laughs> but it just reminded me of like you're going through fl and you're like horns okay or the, remember the casio pianos them uh people used to like like bro casio pianos the fuck all you use that for you know what i'm saying you know what I'm saying? then we get the yamaha motifs or something like that i remember we, i had a yamaha motif you know what i'm saying like that was like yo you got having a yamaha motif at the crib was like having a car you know what i'm saying like straight up you know what i mean like yo you got the motif motherfucker god damn but um motif what motif that's the name of the uh, yamaha i used to have one of them what was it it was something something 88 something it was many moons ago you know what i'm saying you said car for a car no 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 um I, it, it was like i was saying like having that that keyboard oh, in the oh, house yeah, was yeah. like having a car you know what i'm saying <laughs> oh, big man. ass and then it was like i'm a college student no car but i got a yamaha <laughs> fucking uh, uh keyboard in my room and shit like god damn man i remember some old school shit that i got like y'all would be like what the hell like a little boom box right, right. like this jbc maroon boom Eight box track with, with the tax no bro, i ain't that old dog <laughs> but my first car was a doo-doo brown toyota damn. celica toyota celica supra god damn celica Supra tell with a crank back sunroof okay and it did have an eight track in it eight tracks it, it, it was it, it had two but it had an eight track and it had the regular stereo in it so yeah i used to take house speakers and and splice it into the amp and sit in the back yeah Took you know what's crazy? Padre and shit. You know what I'm saying? Remember what's crazy? It's like knowing them eight tracks. If it was a black band or a black artist, Yo. they would always be sweating. The picture would they would just drenched in sweat, <laughs> like ooh, like it is just like sweat coming out of their fucking pores, bro. It's crazy. It's because it was hot in them damn studio. Shit, for real. Listen, uh, that was wobble. Um, yeah, I I like that, uh, um, Pablo. I like the uh, the drops and everything. I'm glad you went back to the lab and kind of remixed that. Uh, Cause it definitely, I I hear the life, the rejuvenation in that. So it was it was that was a dope beat. Um, again, <laughs> what did he say about accusing him about the horns and shit? What did he say? Amza always accuses me of stock horns. You know, you know, you know, I'm just fucking with you. But hey, was it stock though? Let me know, bro. <laughs> the disrespect like, is real. You know what I'm saying? Uh, yeah. Overall, it's a solid. Um, that beat was like for me personally, it was like a solid three point six. I did. I, I like the rejuvenation. I think I'm gonna had. start giving Pablo. Um, um, tasks 
I'll be like, yo, I want you to make a beat like this, a sound like this, and then do whoop de whoop and doop de doop. Yeah, whoop de whoop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yo, we got uh, who is DJ Links next? Who is DJ Links? All right, so cool. Um, DJ Links, we got you right now. So DJ Links sent me something called Lava Cake. Lava Cake. I I think he he may have DM me this. Uh, made this beat last night. Needless to say, by the name, I was smoking something called that, <laughs> and came up with this banger. First edit. So the mix uh, will be better soon. Just did a pre-mix. Got you. Man, I don't think we're going to get to Darius tonight. You don't think so? I'm just fucking with him because already he typed it on his phone right now. No, I've been here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the show's like, oh, my God. How about that other kid, man? We might have to do that because he, he 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 literally, he's in Australia, so I can see why he's always missing Who's the that street. one? Oh, Go- Goopa? Goop. Goop. Or something like no, that. No, it's, it's Goopa. Goopa, I think. But I don't Goopa? see a song from him. Uh, well, you know what? I didn't check my. I'll check my inbox after this record All right. right here. Um, so this is Lava Cake right here. Let's go. Yes. From uh, DJ Links. Free block. fresh uh it, it, yeah like I, I like the like if, if i'm using the right terminology like half notes and stuff like that uh in there like if, if i'm if i'm saying that correctly i mean it's crazy because i've been seeing like all these plugins and shit like that like i just don't like want to like go back down that path because if i get go back down the music gear path it's gonna be like fucking like I just I'll get locked into oh, yeah. it. It'll consume yeah. me. So I'm trying to avoid it. Um, but sometimes I just like, man, I wanna try this, I wanna try that, I wanna try this, I wanna try that. But like I'm just like, oh my God. I'm gonna be consumed by it. Um <laughs> excuse me. But overall, dope beat for sure. Um it, it definitely sounds like something that was really like uh space, like, you know, galactic. You know what I mean? Like you like you said, you was you, you try some lava cake and you know, and you made this beat. Uh, right after it, man. So it, it definitely felt that way. Like I was like, I, I was like, like from like a psychedelic standpoint to a certain degree. If I'm like in a field of grass and I'm, you know, whatever. Um, if it, it, it gave me that kind of vibe, but overall, not bad. You know what I mean? Not bad. I, I enjoyed it. I'm at like a three point uh, seven with this one as well. Yeah, I'm, I can. I'm at a three. I'm three seven. I did like whoa, 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 whoa. You know, it was it was fresh. It, it 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 stayed dancing in my head after it's it's being played, so I do enjoy that. Yeah, and I'm 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 definitely down to hear the the uh, alternative mix to it as well. So I know this was a pre mix, like something just really quickly to kind of export and hear it. Mm-hmm. But I'm mm-hmm. looking forward to hearing the uh, the fully because I know it's gonna the dynamics gonna be crazy. The imaging is gonna be crazy. Feel the grass. Um, yeah. Shout out to everybody, y'all. Oh, what happened there? The, the message disappeared on YouTube. But listen, um, if you guys got friends and homies that do music, um, have them subscribe uh, to the channel, man. We really trying to grow the channel. As you can see, we got a goal. Um, I'm, uh, we're, we're, we're close, but we're not that close. So, man, if you if you know people, have them subscribe to the channel. That would be greatly appreciated, you know, because we okay. got stuff to do. Um, let's continue. So we got uh, Darius with either Fright Night or No Win. I'm kind of curious about Fright Night. 
Darius. Oh, oh, which one do we play? Uh, did he say? Or uh, no, he didn't say. But I'm, I'm I kind of like Fright Night. I like this. Song Me too. Night. He said he's nervous. What did he say? I think I saw he say he's nervous. What did he say that? I just saw his name. No, he said I was scared because I said we weren't gonna get to him. Oh, okay. Wait, where is he watching it? Uh, he should be on YouTube now. Oh, there he is. There he is. I just see it right there. Oh, Do, I, am, Darius. Darius. You know what? And I apologize because he put how to say his he name. Did. He did. He so did. that's I'm like sincere that, that I'm not even playing around. Like that's my fault, man. I and I know that's why you do that because people call you the wrong name. Just be calling you the wrong ass. My name bad, bro. Because I don't like when people fuck up my name either. Um, Darius. Maybe mess with you. Somebody said Amzy the other day, and I was like, no, that's not it. Yeah, yeah, that, 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 that's the that's the popular oh, one. That's not it. I'm like, long guy, did you go to elementary school? <laughs> when the vowels at the end, it's a long guy. Uh, you should try Guilin. You know, people are still fucked up with that shit. Yeah. Got you, got you, got you. Uh, man, thanks for everybody that tuning in, man. We love when the chat is engaged. It actually means a lot. It also actually means a lot when y'all hit that little heart button. Like, hit, yes, somebody hit the heart the button heart so button. I know it's working on, on YouTube. The little heart button right there. You let me yeah, let me know if it's working, I'm, I, and I'll see it on my screen if it is. But let's get to this record by uh, Darius Fright Night. All right, here we go. We going to Spotify for this one. Oh, we're not forgetting about her either. Don't leave, um, uh, Somnia. Don't leave. We got you too. We got you. Uh, MZ is crazy. <laughs> for real, man. Like, what the fuck going on, with y'all? Uh, okay, I see the heart's working. Do it again. Do it again. I, I see. I, I, I saw it working. Do it again. Uh, it is working. It's working. The chat has caught up to my statement. Appreciate y'all. All right, so this is this is frightening. I'll, I'll tell you one thing on TikTok. Yeah. They be like tap tap tap, man. Next thing you know, it's like they get up to nineteen, twenty thousand and shit, and it means something. Man, the highest I got was like fifty k. I was like, damn. I looked down, looked up fifty k. I was like, that's what? crazy. But never got that shit again. Um, <laughs> here we go. Fright night, Darius. Sound like a Mortal Kombat. Uh, well, uh, uh, hey, 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 it's another scary night without his light. Demons even got a bite. Vampire on his blood. Wash it down, holy sprite. Say it, creep it in the cut. Light coming, holy night. This gonna be one heck of a fight. Catch a fan when I see you on sight. It's another scary night. What that is like? Demons even got a bite. Vampire, I need blood. Wash it down, holy sprite. Say that creep it in a cut. Like coming, holy night. This gonna be one heck of a fight. Catch a fan when I see you on sight. It's another scary night. What that is like? Demons even got a bite. Vampire, I need blood. Wash it down, holy sprite. Say that creep it in a cut. It's gonna be one heck of a fight Catch a fan when I see you on sight Can't catch me slipping, I got a good grip I was worried I observed cause I know my ish I'm with it, gotta repent, I did it Devil tripping when he fell in my business I see the vision, I'm like a witness Jesus coming down out of the clouds All me with that man is more than a thousand You really doubt him, I was lost till I found him Wait, look, they was set traps When they really tryna get me That's facts, I got a will He the only one steering That's facts, make it to the holy city but that's depending on the fact Whoa. If I say cool, I'm a sin, I'm gonna be burning Flesh is weak, it's knowing what I like Anger, lust, and riches give me right My uncle showed me righteousness is life Lifestyle was seeking him is right Darkness is creeping in the night Give me Jesus, I'ma need a light Save my soul, he bringing me to life Read this word, I'm training for a fight Anger, lust, and riches give me right My uncle showed me righteousness is life Lifestyle was seeking him is right Darkness is creeping in the light Give me Jesus, I'ma need bad, a light our bad, our bad Jesus, I'm in need of light. Save my soul, he bringing me to life. Read his word, I'm training for a fight. But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. Isaiah 40, 29 through 31. It's another scary night. What that is like? Demons even got a bite. Vampire, I need his blood. Fucked around and played the whole song again. Um, yo, <laughs> yo, yeah, 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 Fright Night. I like, I like, I like that. I like that a lot. It took him a second to get into it, but when he let, he was riding that beat, and it had that little sing songy to his voice too. Shit, right. shit, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, uh, uh, I'm, I'm gonna say 
I, I know I'll be saying 88 glam a lot tonight, but like he they people are sounding like the the the, one, the rappers from that group, man. It's insane. Glam. I have to I gotta check them out. Yeah. I think they're from like somewhere we not somewhere USA or Canada, one of them places, but yeah, he's just it's crazy. Like he sound like the dude from 88 Glam. But anyway, um that was uh Darius with Fright Night. Um you know what I know was really weird? Um is it it, it it was muddy yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah yeah it was muddy it was dope but it was muddy so when i say muddy there's like there's a there's a frequency from on from a beat perspective and a vocal perspective that really sounds like it's just just i don't know what to, like you're caught in something you know what i mean like it's not like it's like you 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 fell into some quicksand. You got up out the quicksand, but that shit is still on you. And you know when you when you get all of the shit off, it's clear, but it's heavy on you. Like that's what it kind of remind me of. So it's kind of interesting, you know. I don't know, you know. I, I I don't know if anybody hears it as well, but I'm not getting that clarity, that proper clarity, you know, that I kind of want out of it because it's such a dope record. Um, shout out to the fucking chat today, man. I see y'all encouraging our, our, our young guy. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, in. yeah <laughs> man. We'll talk about that afterwards. But um, yeah, man. I, I, overall, I did enjoy it. Uh, I did. I just wanted. I just wanted more clarity. That's all. You know what I mean? Like honestly, so that's that's at? what I was at. I'm. I was. I'm at a solid. You know, I, I'm still at a solid three point nine with this one, man. Yeah, I'm, I could. I could go up to four point three on it. Where? Because if they if they fixed it, it it damn near be a five. Like I loved his flow. I love the tone tonality of his voice. It wasn't what we had been hearing all night. The the beat was nice. The flow was nice. It took him a second to get into it. But yeah, it was a little it was it was more than a little muddy. It was not perfect, but it was nice. Darius, how old are you, by the way, Darius? Cause something tells me you motherfuckers are all young tonight. Yeah, it's crazy. Shout out to my sister. Look look out here, like, uh, probably saving lives in the chat. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Shout out to my sister, man. Yo, VV Ren, like, real talk, man. Fuck what people think. Like, if, if I could have learned that at 16 years old, mm. and I, 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 I am sorry, probably agree with me, mm. where we could be right now. Like, not giving a fuck and just following what you want to do. Yeah, they're going to make fun of you for producing music and everything else till you sell a beat for ten, twenty, fifty thousand dollars $50,000. Hey. You know what I'm saying? Till you got credits on somebody's song or till you roll to die with somebody that, like, it just blew up. So everybody got somebody's going to laugh at them and say they can't do it until you do it. You know what I'm saying? So just do it. Man, 100% without a shadow of a doubt, I'm my biggest op. Yeah, we talked about that yesterday. Like... Like, yeah, like when I think about it sometimes, I'm like, biggest me, you know what I'm saying? Uh, in life, there's nobody I'm looking at the guy, you know what I'm saying? That's like, oh, trips over himself in the way, all that shit. So, yeah, I would say, I'm looking at the man that, in the that, mirror. That's and the truth. I would say, try it and send it to us. I mean, you know what I mean? Like, you know, we know we got like a uh, a relatively uh, great community here. I won't even want to say the use relative. We have a wonderful community. People, Sade, we gonna fight, Charday. Hold up. Peep, what's she say? He said his name is Dorai Us. Right? I, I didn't. I, I, didn't I, say I said, it? yeah. I, I made Duh it. I, I corrected myself. Us. I said that. I didn't say Darius again, unless she late. And then she said his name is. That's fine. All right. I stand corrected. Maybe. Dar I us. Oh, is Dar, that how you say it, Dar Galen? Darius. Oh no, you were asking me. I'm sorry, Shade. I thought you were correcting me. I thought you were being Pablo the two. Um Dari us. D U Dari us. My Shade. bad, Shade. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Shade. We gotta get Shade on the show. She she told me like so, a, a, a potential. I, it may be the end of the month. I, I think is it. Let me let me know. That she's gonna be on the show. I thought she was gonna sit in the side with drink. That's what she said. Nah, she gonna she's she's bringing uh like a battle buddy of some sort. Oh, okay, to, okay. You know, so you're an emotional support person. Yes, <laughs> but 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 I think we know them. We it's either gonna be E. Oh, okay. Remember E or um. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, we Kai Factor. Them. Remember Kai Factor? He was yeah. like one of the first back in the, you know with his uh, his Tuesday zone. Um, <laughs> nah, Sade, right here, right here, you know what I'm saying? On nah, stream, on the stream, I'll just point a camera at your ass and you won't even know. Till I'll flip true. it on. That's true. 
<laughs> um, so finally, uh, not finally, but they luck. They luck for love. They looking for love. They they love. Yeah, yeah. How do you say that? They they lo- uh, love Ken. Oh, that that they love Ken. Oh, they love Ken. They love Ken. There it is. They love Ken. Oh, yeah, they yeah. love Ken. Yeah. No, that wouldn't be Ken. Can. A four is not an E. A three is an E. Oh, you're right. Probably. <laughs> Let us know. He said I'll have to. You know, I'm uh, kind of busy. Okay, got you, got you, got you. Um, listen, Lifeline. This, this record is called Lifeline. This is not fully mixed. They was really in the chat, like, yo, play my stuff, play my stuff. Here it is. Here it is. One minute. One minute. Let's go. She say I'm the worst. Uh, I think I'm the best. Uh, she fell in love, but she won't say it with her chest uh, Splitting up again, I know we'll meet up in the end But right now I don't need love, I'm needing something like a friend Lying to her friend, she told him that she hated me Don't know why she shamed me it's Supposed to be my lifeline, I thought that you saved me You've been acting different lately, not knowing that it pays me Brighten up your day, but now you move we got some young folks on the show today. Up in the mirror, I can't recognize myself. And this liquor in this cup only made my chest feel like hell. Don't wanna talk about it when I do, I don't feel like myself. The way I'm pouring in this cup, hoping that I would drown myself. When I try to hear your ghost, just bring me back to that hotel. Just take my heart, I'll let you crush it, leave me alone and wish me well. You really showed me that I didn't need nobody but myself. I walk alone, I've been alone, but that could change the time with time. Can't live me up in my face. Yeah, man, we got some young, you got some young people in here today, man. This is wild. Uh, shout out to everybody, you know, doing music, taking this, 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 this thing, maybe um, obtaining capital or funds to purchase this equipment to make and produce music, or you know, use band labs. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I'm curious to see if um, they actually use band labs for this. You know, because uh, what I've heard, I, I, I heard new. I heard meaning like uh maybe the maybe newly starting their artist journey uh look at look at two white hop in here you know what i'm saying <laughs> um yeah so i i, I think this this artist is like a new artist a young artist kind of like exploring this the music you know what i mean I, I could be wrong but um i think this is something new a new venture uh maybe they have been writing music for a while and then um recently maybe like hey let's record music i heard that like i didn't hear season i didn't hear like like i usually say diaphragm you know which mm-hmm. a lot of mm-hmm. artists i don't hear honestly but this one it just i didn't hear that confidence yet you know what i'm saying I'm not saying he that he's not confident as a you know outside of music i'm just saying like musically i didn't hear that like like i'm supposed to be here you know i'm supposed to be doing this kind of energy you know what i mean um but obviously probably deeply influenced by like the likes of juice world and you know I, I, all, tons of other artists uh kind of that sounds similar but overall uh early early mix you know what i mean here um i'm probably giving give, give this song like a solid it's like a solid two for me it's a solid two for me yeah i'm a, I'll, I'll go along with you at a two as well um not a lot more to say on that just is what it is so i i, I concur with that uh two white just jumped in so um we'll we'll play a minute of two white who came in at 8 46. two white my yeah. man two white is a family man so yeah he, he is he, yeah I mean, he is <laughs> um vv ren you said i'm a songwriter as well i don't rap on my song so sir we got a task within the next three songs that you send to us one of those i want to hear you rap on it yeah matter of fact if you do rap on it, Woo. we'll put you at the front of the line Woo. above anybody else. Any, anybody else, whenever you come, you got you rapping on the song within the next two shows. Within the next two shows. Mark the tape. Within the next two shows, we'll bump you to the front of the line. Period. <laughs> he said, I feel like you can't prove it's a ring below 2.5 with... <laughs> with with the with the word solid. That's funny. He said, "Damn." Hey, actually, <laughs> matter of fact, 
Damn. Yeah. <laughs> um, let's continue. So who we got next? Um, we, we're just about out of here. Um, two white. One minute, two white. Eight forty six. Got you. Too white, very rough mix, so don't judge the mix too hard. LOL. Literally just want uh wait, literally just left the studio with uh but really want to share the song. Uh finished mix will change everything though. Here we go. So this record is called I Don't Know or excuse me, I don't care or IDK. Here we go. One minute. Let's go. I don't care what they think about me. I don't care what they want. I don't care what they say. I don't care what y'all speak around me. I don't care where they go. I don't care what they say. I don't care. I won't drink about these thoughts. I won't think about this hate. Never know. I won't stick around these days. And I'm now cleaning up my ways. I'm good. I'm good. Shit. All I know, my wife's ass fat, man, I'm blessed, I'm good, I don't stack stats You blessed when posting your cash app, man, that's facts, rap, but don't blast back Cause you trash, in fact, and that's easy You lack a sad, you can't see me, man, cause you Muggsy Bogues, I'm Zach Eady Nah, but that's cheating it's just I know you can't reach me. You couldn't touch the flow or even rub the bows. I mean, nothing close. I stand freely. I get the crush and skulls with my CD. But I've been feeling comfy close with my three. We be laughing just composed. It's my team. My family is what I know that I need. I hope you all see. I don't care what they think about me. I don't care what they want. I don't care what they say. I don't care what y'all see. See, that piano fucking goes hard. See, <laughs> this is why I'm like, like some... Fatigue audio wise is a real thing, right? And so in in training the ear is like a it's a it's a mastery thing. So even me, I struggle, right? With a couple of things. So coming into the studio, I was listening to music and extremely loud in speakers, car speakers like just bumping shit and you know, Bluetooth headphones and just, just different, different sources. Then I come here and I put in pro level headphones, right? And it, it can be like your your ears are trying to like adjust and like, okay, but this is, is it, is it truly there? Is it not? But this mix where it is right now, this get brings back the confidence in me making this purchase. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because the way they exported it, the way they mix it, it may not be the final, but like every, it's just the way they mixed it. it it's like, I, it's, it's almost like if I'm wearing, um, blinders, wait, um, what's the thing called? Like the Apple pro vision. What's the thing called? The yeah, Apple yeah, the pro vision. Yeah. It's like my, these headphones are converting my sight into that. And I can see things like, you know, it's telling me in, in this particular mix is it, it's showing me like everything was, uh, imaged center around not like here there 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 it's like center around and it sounded good it sounded like this is where it's telling me where the vocals are sitting in the mix like it's creating the image for me these headphones you know what i'm saying it's it's, it's weird because some other headphones it doesn't it's only like the driver's audio this way you know what i'm saying but this is like it's, it's telling me like exactly where it's sitting in the mix you know what i mean it's crazy, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Sade said, Amzai, you high. <laughs> mm -mm. Hey, ask, ask, ask Pharrell what I'm talking about. Oh, shit, he said Pharrell. Yeah, ask these guys that say they see things when they're producing. You know what I'm saying? So do you see um, um, images? Like, it, I'm sorry, do you see um, colors? Not necessarily colors, it's just okay. giving me like a... Um, I'm telling you, ask these guys like Rick Rubens and these other guys like what they see when they're hearing music. I'm telling you, yeah, it's yeah. a real thing. I, I'm telling you, um, but this is like you have to like again. This this like if you mix music or you've been in a, you've been in the studio with engineers for a long time, and how people can like pinpoint okay, this sound of this human voice. If I scrub. <clears throat> The frequency, uh, the multi-band EQ, I can find that sound we want to get out. That's how powerful EQ is. Like, but that's how powerful your ears are. Not everybody got that shit. Bro, I'm telling you. Like, you can be like, oh, I know, I know what that is. And then, because there's a there's a game that you can play online when it's like, guess this frequency. 
and you See, gotta you, yeah. you and 10 other people have done that I mean I, I only did it once but like there's a gang like where people go and they're like boom boom oh this is and you're like oh fuck I got it wrong and they do it again and, they, and they, you're playing it yeah that's it, wild yeah it's yeah, almost synesthesia is when you see in colors yeah, yeah. I, I don't have that I don't have that it's just it, they're just telling me where it sits in the mix other headphones are just they're just noise you know what I'm saying so anyway uh yeah. overall I said all I have to say that it's a dope mix of where it's at right now <laughs> <laughs> and I can't wait to hear uh, where the final mix is you know what I'm saying um, so shout out to Two White man I'm definitely giving this record like a solid 4-2 out of 5 early I know it's early but I think the final mix is going to be absolutely crazy 4-2 4.2. Yeah, I, I'm, I can go with right there with you. I did enjoy it. I enjoyed it a lot. And, and he was talking grown man shit, too. Man, remember that one song he sent about his family? Yeah. I fucking love that song, man. Shout out to Garfield. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay. Did you? I'm sorry. Did you? Oh, yeah. You did say your take right there. Okay. So, boom. Yeah. Um, we rocking. We rocking. Oh, shit. Um, Miss Somnia. Wait, wait, wait. Say it again. Somnia. Okay. And by the way, Somnia is a gentleman. In, insomnia. Huh? Somnia is a gentleman. What? Remember? <laughs> yeah. Just was, I thought I, I thought you saw that. Yeah. Somnia is a gentleman. Right? Like, let me... I, I saw the chat earlier. Let me I'm know. I'm looking at the picture, though. And, okay. I just... Ignorance is bliss. No, no, no. I, I did. I did the same thing, but they, they, they did. He did arrest us. Um, what do you think? Wait, what did he say? What did Two White say? Um, what do you think? Uh, the sound. What do you think this? Uh, of the sound though. Oh, song though. Wait, I thought. We... Bruh. Okay, it's a dude. <laughs> <laughs> uh... No, no, no. I, I, I had my boy. Yes, yeah, so that's what my sister said. She was like, I had my boy, Damien. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, my bad. Um, <laughs> no, I, I, I thoroughly liked the song. I thought the song was fire, um, and I like I, I like the the uh, the way Two uh really in the studio, like really cooking this up, and uh, <laughs> you know, really, really probably behind the engineer, like yo, I want this, I want that, I want that. Really kind of like soundscaping this whole thing. So the song was dope, man. The beat was fire. Everybody concurred that the beat was fire. So and I, I think everybody's looking forward to the final mix on this as well. If, if this was on a cutting board to make an EP or something like that, I'd be like, yo, keep it. You know what I'm saying? Keep yeah. it for, like, the the latter part of the project. You know what I'm saying? All right. Um, continue. Hi, right, my boy. Amen. All right. Um, where we at again? We uh, are 1108. 1108. Second to last song of the night. Second to last. 1108. Let's get it. All right. So we got New York in the building. So, you know. Uh, just made it. That's what they said in the, uh, in the chat uh, or in the comment of the song. So let's get it. This record is called C. Here we go. Yeah. Shogun in Paris. Yeah. 
Yeah. A dope ass rap. Ooh, I got it. I got it right. So a dope ass like a songwriter like Ty Dolla Sign on this. I know it's different, but like imagine Ty Dolla Sign on that shit right there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, I, I know it's unmixed, but like my thing is okay. The 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 same ranking system still uh, pertains. You know what I'm saying? Mix. Replay value moved. That doesn't change, right? So to me, it did have a moderately higher replay value me because it had a nice groovy feel, Gambino feel to a Jalas Gambino kind of feel. You know what I'm saying? Like Redbone. It had that, you know what I'm saying? The bass slap, you know? So, um, or the um the the rose, like or maybe a rose piano, something. It was something in there that was keeping melody going and stuff like that. Doom, doom, do, 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 do. So I think I, it was something there. So those things are important when making songs because that's what kind of obviously we know the hook is important and those mm-hmm. those melodies keeps us going back to the record. And I know I talk about K-pop a lot, um, but like that's what that's why these th- these things have billions of fucking streams because of that melodic pop bright chords and shit like that you know what i mean um and then the plus the the, the, the large type demographic that listens to it but um this song had that kind of feeling for me as far as a higher replay value it, of course it was the mix the mix wasn't there there yet but they were sitting in a good spot according to these headphones but it just the clarity piece and the dynamic or harmonic saturation wasn't there all the way so um for this mix it was a it was a decent mix in a good spot looking forward to hearing a, a, a alternative version of the mix so i'm at like a solid with that being said i'm at a solid 3.8 actually man because I, I i under i get it like i understand the intention behind it but go ahead gala no um enjoyed it enjoyed it a lot and i had a lot more to say about it uh <clears throat> right, right right but it, it was yeah. i'm sorry it was a little muddy um, but the mix overall, I, I like the song. I, I the feeling that it gave me was, you know, really Bobby and Poppy. So I, you know, when I say Bobby, like I'm bobbing my head over here. I'm like, okay, okay. So yeah, I'm I'm at a um, three six. Okay, what preset? What what VS? What what program were you using? What DAW did you use? And what um, what preset did you use for the VST that you were using? You know what I'm saying? Uh, word to sonically, word to dynamically, you know what I'm saying? Ickly, you know, I like to add that glee in at the end, you know what I'm saying? Um, last song, so I think we made it to the last record of the night, y'all. Want to appreciate y'all, man. Um, looking, man, we got some cool things maybe happening next month. We're gonna lock it down first, um, see what happens. Um, but man, it's, it's some big and bright things cooking, man. Live studio audience. You know, it's the planning part for me. If I didn't have to plan that, I would do that shit all the time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if I didn't have to book the people to be on the show, I would do it all the time, y'all. But, you know what I'm saying? Until I, uh, it, if you use Band Labs, it's cool. Like, you know what I'm saying? Because this is a Band Lab community here. You know what I'm saying? Or Audacity? I'm, okay, I was using Reaper. Reaper. Hmm. So you, to record the audio, you use Reaper? Cause when I think Reaper, I'm thinking, uh, let me know in the chat. But yeah, we got some cool things cooking, man. Um, uh, looking forward to, you know, kind of having you guys involved, uh, and stay tapped in, man. Make sure to, uh, have everybody that, you know, subscribe to the channel that you deem, uh, this channel would help them, you know, whether it be, you know, from a mental health standpoint or a music standpoint, you know, we want to, you know, uh, you know, build this audience based on that. And, uh, authenticity you know so if that's if that you know some people have to tell them to come through um he said <laughs> he said if you use audacity though that's a little problematic hell yeah i'm i'm, I'm like yo we check on this person please you know if they out here using audacity like oh my god um uh, shout out audacity you know respectfully Last song of the night. I'm sorry, God. Who was it again? Uh, it is Benji Vala. So that's uh, Goo Goo Gu, um <laughs> Yeah, right. <laughs> uh, Gupa. 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 Hey, he, hey, he better not DM me talking about, hey, you better be here. Well, he I, was here a few minutes ago. I know he in Australia, but he better be here. All right, here we go. Benji. See, let me see if I can say this right. Benji. Benji. Benji Vala. Benji Vala. 
I can't like Benji Vala. Benji Vala. Okay, so here we go. Um, no Auto Benji. That's the name of the song. A little freestyle. Um, but my man was really reaching out to me to uh to um I think you can use Reaper for Wirecast actually. Um they have like compressors and everything like that. Um Benji Vala. My man was DMing me all the way from uh from Australia. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like yo, every time I, you know, every time I want to see the music, y'all close. You know what? We got you today. You made it. You made it. Here we go. So hopefully you don't let us down because this is the last song of the night. Uh, I want to thank everybody that tuned in today um, and tapped in. Uh, we do have some really cool giveaways coming up eventually um, that we're gonna be announcing probably next week. I'll probably have it ready next week. Um, so always tap in with us on Instagram. Bookmark the website, uh, become a uh, subscribe to the website so you know when we go live or just different things are happening, or you get an email or text when we go live, all that shit, man. Make sure I do that because some people get texts every time we go live and then they text me during the show as well, which is uh, which is which is dope. So y'all just get ready. <coughs> Here we go. Last one tonight, Benji Vala, uh, no out of tune, also known as uh, Guapa. I think if I'm saying that correctly. Um, she said, uh, I was watching a wavy Wayne interview producers uh, at <laughs> MusicCon or whatever it's called, and they said FL Audacity with a word. I did see that too. See, our algorithm, we probably got the same algorithm Shit that comes up, right? Yeah, we, we, me, yeah, because I saw that video too. <laughs> Here we go, y'all. Um, let's see what Benji got from Australia. Da -da -da. Oh. Yeah, I agree. Hey, I agree. Hey, hey. I be quiet and embarrassed, bitch. Don't know how to handle shit. Don't know how to sleep wow. at night. Don't know how to be alright. Don't know how to spend my time. Yeah. Fuck, I'm wasting time. Oh. I'll be sad, but fuck it, I'll be fine. Bitch, I need some peace of mind. Got some shit to leave behind. Feel the start of bullshit coming, cause she do this every time. I don't write shit, I just rap whatever comes to mind. From my last seven songs, I ain't write a single line. How come I ain't blew up yet? I think about it all the time. Gotta keep the pistol gripping on my side. I Keep an on, so sleeping on a kid. When the fuck can I get signed? Had to cut her off. That bitch trying to knock me off the grind. I'm on blow, I swear to God, it's just a matter of time. But I'm broke as hell. Bitch, I need some change. I'll be rich as hell. I'll have everything. Say a single word and everyone say that I changed. Fuck driving cars, I'm gonna book a fucking plane. As soon as he got rich, he bought a chain that's fucking lame. But honestly, I'd probably do the same. Get off the last. Why the fuck you shoot the ball? There's an open pass. Mm. Bad bitch, nice face and hella fucking ass. Baby, come here, let me smash. It was cool until I found out about her past. Now my dick hurt like a bitch. Damn, now I got this rash. Drop the hell me. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is that? He yeah. said, Benji, who you fuck? I Good said, just a name. bitch from class. He said, okay, take these pills. I don't think that shit will last. But it did. That's the reason why you don't fall hoes for cash. Bitch, damn, my dick still hurt. <laughs> wow, bro. The energy, man. What? The energy. He said, right? <laughs> Listen. Like, let's get out of here, Scoob. <laughs> Listen, man. I I I I was expecting honestly, I'ma be honest. I I I I was not expecting that. Absolutely not. And I was pleasantly surprised, man. It's crazy because I think he said he's from Australia. But the flow was kind of Florida-ish, mm. crazy. He kind of sound like we know the like an artist from Florida. Interesting, like the, the just the like I mean I heard like BLP kosher. I heard like um fucking beat, Glock yeah. Nine, like you know, but not 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 as aggressive as Glock Nine, but like definitely like a BLP kosher for sure. Um, wow, that's interesting. Um, but absolutely like i had no qualms about that mix like i was not mad at that mix at all set perfectly in these headphones now now i'm See, starting that's to understand weird now i'm starting to understand because i heard all kind of issues yeah with like the vocals tell me about it because it, it, I, 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 it felt I, over I, it, it i i it sell it <laughs> It didn't feel like the music was in the pocket or like 
on top of the beat. It felt, I don't know, it felt separated. It didn't feel well, conjoined. You, I think you used the word bassy. So tell me, like, did you were you were you about to use the word bassy at the yeah, beginning? Yeah, no, it was a lot of bass. Okay, it was a lot of bass in the in the um in the beat or the yeah vocals? in the beat. Okay, cool. Because I was wanting to make sure because I because if you would say vocals, I'm like I I 100% did because vocals can be bassy yeah. too. No, no, no. Yeah, but it I didn't hear that. It wasn't like bassy or muddy or anything else like that. Yeah, so. So you, you said you, so the vocals wasn't muddy. No, right? they weren't muddy. They just See? they just didn't seem. That's like... why I wasn't mad at it because yeah. if it's mud, if it's boxy, I didn't hear mud or boxy at all. Right. You know what no, I'm saying? no, no, not at all. So that's why I said I wasn't necessarily mad at the vocal mix because if we can reduce boxy and muddy, I'm I'm kind of you know <laughs> I can kind of. Yeah. After that, it's clarity right, and dynamics. Right, right. But like, if we get rid of the other shit, I'm, I'm kind of like I, I, I'm giving passes. You know what I'm saying? Because we hear a lot of mixes where it's like boxy, nasally mud. I'm yeah. like, oh god, like what? How did y'all? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but, I think I think one of the things with your with those headphones in general, Amzai, is like it's gonna force you to pay attention a little bit more. Because I think you got you know you're used to doing like stuff and listening and stuff and doing other stuff, and now because it's like a, a slightly new sound, you have to pay a little bit more attention mm -hmm. to the mix, and then then just because it's like it's not the same that you're used to hearing all the time. Yeah, let me look. Uh, let me see something real quick before we get out of here, so y'all can. Uh, these are there. They are right here. So I want to let's see something real quick. Let's look at the let's look at the uh, the response frequency. I was about to say the, the frequency response. Let's see, cause uh, I need to go to the actual website probably. You know what I'm saying? But like, I just want to see something real quick because what I'm, what I'm, you are correct. It, it is forcing me to kind of um, focus, and it is, it's actually making me um, like it, it's, it's helping me point it's find this shit. You know what I'm saying? It is it, here. We go. Audio specifications. Okay, so so it's a wide bandwidth. Like a lot of headphones don't have go from five to forty thousand hertz. Um, Damn, I was looking for the the uh the pictures of it. Just to see. Anyway, um these are closed back uh headphones, superior isolation, improved low end frequency. I definitely hear that. So what I from 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 what I gather, like the drivers are are powerful enough to deliver like a really nice um uh rich sound. And so what I heard from that song we just heard right now um was a contained bass there was one song that you can hear like the bass she was like thumping but this was contained and almost like they used some type of i talked about it earlier like a side chain with the kicks mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying bugs on my face you know what i'm saying um but anyway um i don't want to nerd out too much on it but um i was hoping i could see a picture of the the, the frequency response chart but anyway overall I, I i did like it you know um but these are the new headphones i just got right now y'all look y'all look them up and tell me what y'all think about them i'm gonna put them in the chat you know so just so y'all can see what y'all think about the specs later on oh that's not the right uh remove but Gallon, man, we made it to the end of the show. Again. Um, I mean, great, amazing <laughs> show. Yeah, it was a good show. It was a solid show. It was a solid show. Um, thoroughly enjoyed everybody's company today. We had Flu here earlier. If you want to follow Flu, his information is in the chat. Um, we'll get with y'all on social media for the dates uh, next week um, and uh, go from there. Uh, like I said, we got some really cool things lined up. Looking forward to kind of chopping it up with you guys about it. Um, and man, I want to play in a live studio audience, Gala. Hey, probably, well, we could do one next week. We can reach out to some people next week for Greg. Oh, yeah. Okay. Woo. So, Greg, when it, it's Thursday. We do a Thursday, right? I'm pretty sure I got to double check, but yeah. All right. We good. We go for Thursday, man. But like, bro, we got some shit to talk about. Like, what are we doing? I know. I know. Holy we'll fuck. Get, we got it. We got it. We got it. Yeah. All right, man. We all have a good one, man. We, it was a great. Hopefully, y'all subscribe to the channel. Hopefully, if you were new and you came from TikTok, you fuck with the vibes and the energy, and we want you to become a part of the community that we're trying to grow, whether it be on social media or on Discord eventually. You know what I mean? So definitely do that and subscribe to the channel. 
join the discord and we'll see y'all uh next week we got a special i'm deeming it as a special broadcast a special broadcast that it is Spe- special it's gonna be special it's broadcast gonna be nice, man it's gonna i don't be know nice. how we doing it what we doing but we doing it man we're gonna be here man y'all have a good night peace man let me hit my let me hit my covenant macaroni with, with the, the chicken, chicken strips, strips.